Ladies and gentlemen, Thursday night footy has arrived. <laughs> Fucking patrol! Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> that there was you great. Go. I that didn't was, know was going. That was nice. Bad dragon. Can you give us a fire up? I told you. Yeah. No, I don't. Yeah. We can't flog, my favorite a, bit. flog a winning horse. <laughs> but you know my favourite bit about the fire-ups? It's oh, not the fire-up. It's the, the like, <laughs> one of... <laughs> He's got a fucking neck. I was neck. complaining about the neck on the way here. He's got a bad neck. Anyway, Sorry, but carry on. The lines that he says, like, it's like two or three lines before the fire up. is I look at this dragon's train and I see nothing but trash. <laughs> <laughs> and when you hear the trash drop, you're like, okay, the fire up's coming yeah. in, like, a couple of lines now. And the spit the, in some bits where he's just, like, Dude, he did one the other day. It's I think it was for, like, passion. I don't know if it was for just a trial game as the internet wigs out. Um... If it was for a trial game or something, but he's in a singlet and he's in his living room and he's walking and he's in this really tight singlet and he's got this fat, like, don't, round donut of belly button sweat that's <laughs> soaked through the shirt. That was a trial. That was a trial. Um, and in, in fairness to the Mad Dragon, I, you know, it would have been, been a hot day in Perth. The trials are obviously in February and he had the tightest singlet of all time on. Like, maybe something he wore when he was a teenager. Yeah. It was fucking tight as shit. But that's why we love him, because the right. man's prepared to... He doesn't care about fashion. He cares about the dragon. That's it. That's no. all he cares about. It We're underway here, boys. Just a quick clock check, punters. Uh, we are at 39, 51, 50, 49, 48, 47, 46, 45, 39, 45. Uh, just quickly as well, a bit of housekeeping. We do have a phone line now, so you can send in some text messages. You can also just leave them in the chat, though. Text, uh, the number is 0438144593. You can also call us. We will take some calls. Sebo's here. Hamish is here. Eddie's here. And myself is here. Um, and Thursday Night Football. Thursday Night Footy's here. You quick, can't beat it. Quick first try scorers. Scotty Sorensen. Dylan Edwards. Dylan Edwards. Dylan Edwards as well. Martin. Martin. Big Liam Martin. Love yeah. that. Country boy. Did you see Dylan Edwards play in, against Para last week? How fucking good he was. He's, he, got, he's got blue written all over him this year. Well, he's a rugby league footballer, but the problem is that he's there are better fullbacks. He's yeah, he's fucking good, but there's but just But it's better just fullbacks. like he's just still knocking on the door though. Mm. Like Oh, um, he's not knock, he's knock, listen, knocking on heaven's door. Yeah. Listen, he's he's caroling at Christmas, but he's not caroling as well as others, you know yeah. what I mean? <laughs> like yeah, I'm yeah. not going to necessarily le let you in for eggnog. Yeah. <laughs> but I but I yeah. appreciate that you're turning up in the snow but to give it a crack. Aaron plays a role, yeah. you know. He's, he's a backup. He's guy. good, no, but he's yeah. never going to be that number one. No. Well, but it's like act, like Gary Oldman's like the best actor of all time. How many feature movies is he the leading actor in? None, right? Like Just better like, for it that he's not. Yeah, in exactly. A way, right? exactly. Hey Sebo, can yeah. you as a cameraman go and check why we look so fucking dark on this one? Because the boys are trying to work out. It looks like it's. Oh, we're good. Okay, sweet. Thank you. We're back. Gary Oldman, but he was, wasn't he in Churchill the last, wasn't he? In, oh, he uh, was, he was. He won an Oscar for that. I okay. saw that at the... Okay, I haven't seen Churchill, uh, but also... Gary Oldman won an Oscar. He should, because he's, that guy's a chameleon. Yeah, like, maybe I've got no, my no, actors no, wrong. No, I mean, the point still stands, because normally No, it is he Gary is. Oldman. He's won an no, Oscar. It is. It is. Um, but he's the he's the the best supporting actor. He's also of in a great time. show now called Slow Horses. It is the best show. <laughs> you don't talk about any of these fucking shows, dude. I've talked about Slow Horses. You haven't talked about Slow Horses. You haven't talked about Slow yet. Horses. It's the Jesus best show Christ. out. It's the best British show out at the moment. Oh, it Slow is. Horses yeah. is my absolute. It's probably my favourite show yeah. on television. It's like yeah. right silent now. Uber. Yeah. Some these guys on the way to work. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> then lights up and yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, where's the chat, dude? Yeah, where's the horse? You don't watch shows. You don't watch shows. What are you Oh, you yeah. I, would, I would if you let me know. You're not going to watch the horses. Again. What do you mean? I watched The Last of Us. I watched uh, the... I'll put this out here. I'll put this out there that Tom has not watched all of Lord of the Rings. Which rules all three of them. Of, but yeah. Yes, I have. Have you watched The Extended? But do, you, do you like it? No, no. I haven't seen well, I don't love The Lord of the Rings. It doesn't count. Though. I don't mind it. I've, what it is, it counts. You no, it love doesn't. You've, you've got, got to love it. You right? couldn't think of a second show. And that's fine if you've watched... <laughs> no, no, no. Well, like, one of the most recent ones, One Day? Who watched that? <laughs> <laughs> that show's fucked. That was fucked. That show was, yeah, was fucked up. My dick you and I don't talk about shows. It's not our thing. No, it's but, my but, thing with Sebo. No, 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 I know. But sometimes I reckon the punter and the dribbler might want to hear of a good show that you're watching. Okay, currently right now, Shogun. Shogun. Yeah, yeah. Watch See, Shogun right Kempi now. Kempi was talking about that today yeah. as well. Like, Shogun's great. But there's a good show. You finish a good show and you only have to wait three weeks until, it, like, a se second season comes out or a new good show pops up. Oh, Bronx on the attack here. I want to watch that, Sebo, because um, someone told me 
literally in the Uber you, on the way here. That uh, it has a bit of a Game of Thrones behead. Well, that's yeah, what but Kempi had said. But it's, it's a little bit more Realistic. like authentic, but still yeah. thrown. But <laughs> yeah. you know that if anyone's seen Last Samurai, there's that samurai who like doesn't trust him. I that seen good that, like no. at, like uh, oh, anyway, he's the main guy, and you're like Tom Cruise. No, no, no Broncos no, no, no. on the attack here. Chuck Madden. Oh. Sorry. Uh, also, gentlemen, punters, dribblers. Worth reminding that Titanic trivia makes its triumphant return. Yeah. So amazing. Triumphant return at halftime. Like how fucking jacked he is. I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what makes it so good. I was going to Tom on the way here. I go, and then we've got another Titanic here. Yeah. And it's, like, it's a double barrel to, too. When oh, I had to is cover it? For it's a DB. You, I'm going to double barrel. When I had to cover for you when you weren't here and did it, I was like a little bit nervous. I'm like, oh, I don't know if everyone's going to get it. You just have to go, well, I think this is a pretty good Easter egg. I'll go with it. Reece but Walsh you every week, it's oh, like right. Eddie doesn't have to convince himself that this is a good a good fucking well, uh, Titanic. Can I tell you something that, that has both troubled and disturbed me? I know they're similar words, but it, I need to use both of them. Cody, our white mumba, Mr. Totebag himself, has never seen Titanic. And it just was it was brought up again today. He's never seen it. Fucked me up. He hasn't seen Lord of the Rings. He hasn't seen Lord of the Rings. Haven't you? No, he went and did a big old... He watched the first one last week. (laughs) Yeah. I messaged him going, how did you like it? And he goes, oh, I I see how it was probably a time and place thing. Oh, what the fuck? Time and... (laughs) Listen, I don't even like that movie that much. It's a time and place. (laughs) That's really weird. When I mentioned it, I was not implying, you know, you know... Subliminally to you. I but was, just uh, quick note, Lord of the Rings, when we were like 12 when they came out, and it is like movie of a generation. Just June? quickly here, hold on. D- d- <coughs> I just need to, because we are watching this game, yeah. he's got a fight. He got put on report for a head clash. How the f- Well, I'll tell you, he's got he's to start playing football without a head, Tom. But, I mean, I just didn't feel like that was... Did I miss something there? But, like, it didn't feel like... Oh, he's, it, they're saying he's gone high. Let's quickly get it. Go for it. Yeah, bring it. it. Bring it over. It's in the fridge. Straight. Freezer or fridge? That's in the, where there's no room. Ice. I, I didn't want to take ice out. No, I understand. Broncos plus ten and a half. Thank you so much. Um, Aren't you Broncos at plus, eight? plus eight? Yeah, but I got. I just mean I got on it this evening when it was plus ten and a half. It was more where I was at. Sure. Uh Anyway, as you were, in the fridge. Oh, in the fridge. As sorry. I was saying, every like 10, 15 years, a movie experience comes out. Lord of the Rings was us when we were like young teenagers. Uh, June 2 is the one for your guys' generation. If you're like 13 to yeah. 24. It, it, June 2. Go watch one now twice. So but you, you did you, have you seen it again since you fell asleep in it? No, but I listened to a couple podcasts. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, I went to the 1 p.m. session. It was the first. This is the second time I've been out of the house having twins. Um... First one was June, last weekend, and I went to 1 p.m. session going, just don't fall asleep, dude. Get a giant Coke. Try to stay awake. <laughs> and movies are created in three acts, and in between each act, a pivotal plot point happens. What point do you think I fell asleep in twice? Right in between the bridges of what's going on. And I'm like, fuck's sake. But it so was you, epic. Yeah, listen, the, the problem is, and we were musing about this in the green room uh, a few days ago, Sebo, that Hoyt's... And this isn't an ad, punters and dribblers, but you got to shout out quality when it yep. comes across your desk. Yep. It's as simple as that. Hoyts have gone out of their way for the punter and the dribbler and gone, listen, the recline chair, as luxurious as it is, used to be only for the gold class operator, the ridgy didge, the man who's prepared, or woman who's prepared to splash the big cash. Not anymore. Every single seat... Okay, at least at Entertainment Quarter, at least at Broadway. Yeah, Broadway, yep. Is full recline. So you got a yep. man who's had fucking an hour's <laughs> sleep in the last week and you give him a reclining <laughs> seat, a big yeah. a big cushy one, that's big trouble. Yeah, yeah. And big, like, big trouble. I mean, I was always do- doing it even before kids. Avatar too. didn't finish that. Um, <laughs> didn't even get past the f- first flashback. Yeah. Um, but, uh, I didn't see Avatar 2 any good. Uh, well, the second, or has James Cameron lost the, his touch? The worst bit is the second time I watched it, I was home alone. Millie was overseas, I think. And um, I Wayne? took one of the gummies and I took too much of a dose. And I, I like, I couldn't watch it. I, I was just trying to go. <laughs> I was going, just try focus on the movie because I'm wigging out so hard and I don't want to <laughs> deal with my own thoughts. I knew that I was having oh, twins at this fine. point in time. So the internal anxiety was like just... just <laughs> oh! 
It was what powerful. Yeah, and I was like, I, isn't I'll, that annoying? Sometimes when you have a gummy <laughs> and you're like ready for it just to fully like immerse yourself in whatever you're that, doing. And you're like, ah shit, nah, I was I'm taking, out. Yeah, I was taking grenades in the big city. Like I even had a, a tea time booked the next morning oh, for that sake. I pulled out of because I had spent all no. night just wigging out. I was just like, I can't oh no! Been, I was Did like, you pull out of it the night before? No, the morning. I just oh, woke so you woke up. up still wigging. No, because like I was just <laughs> so tired because I spent the whole night just trying to focus on Avatar, and then I tried to rewatch it because I'm like, just get me out of here. And it's, Wallace, where are you? Where's my giant teddy? Um, no, it just fucked me. Um, That's funny. Ben, Ben, you know Ben, yeah, um, brother-in-law. Smokes heaps of weed. He would not mind me saying so. Um, so I'd say his and last I think he, name, maybe. No, 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 I won't. <laughs> and then he he had those gummies. And then you know how you like have a little bite of the cube. He had three of the cubes. Oh shit! In one shit. sitting because he loved after the first cube hit, and he was like, "I go, do you have the whole thing?" He goes, "Yeah, I'm having the best time." And I go. Dude, That's slow down, slow down on those. And then he had the second, then he had a third. He said he, he had to cancel all his tennis lessons. <laughs> the next day. Yeah. Tennis oh coach. God. And he said he woke up <laughs> the next day. He couldn't leave the bed. Yeah. So he had to stay in bed all day because he was just so um, fucking high. Sometimes he fighting. Had to stay in yeah. bed all the next day. Fighting those battles are harder than With fighting a, a physical battle sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> someone sent a message someone sent a message going, Sebo we get it you love your kids can you love a tech for me brah <laughs> the, uh, listen the amount of people in there that want you to have a tequila is, is overwhelming up. I'm They're winding them up trying to work this is the first fucking night this <laughs> entire <laughs> year that I've stayed awake past 8pm exactly so you should celebrate I'm easing my way into it and I've only had two hours sleep last night so if I have a tech now I'm fucked Drink me <laughs> Drink me <laughs> Go to bed, Jessica. <laughs> oh. oh, good stuff. In your own time. Get him a cup. Yeah, nothing in like, know, in nothing your own like time. fucking bullying your mate into drinking tequila. Yeah, you have yeah, a drink. When you're 35, yeah. it doesn't matter. Self can. That's true. You're not 16. No, yeah. It's not no, the it's great. You know Listen, you it's are. a great point. You're an alcoholic. Uh, <laughs> 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 Bit of a score uh, check, I reckon. 2-0 through 32-25. No, no, no. So 32-25 left. Yep. 2-0. Brisbane. Uh, and the screen uh, has frozen. Great. Internet, eh? Loading. Internet. There we go. We're no, back on. We are still on 32-25. 32-22. Uh, how, how about 32, this? 20, and I got 19, this, got this from looking at... Um, sorry. You, no, no. It's all right. Okay. It's all right. There will be blood, one of the greatest films of all time. Daniel Day Lewis, in one of the scenes to his baby on the train, he, he puts a little bit of whiskey in the bottle. Yeah, and that's, that's what he used to do. Oh, they used to do that. Yeah, yeah, this year, the film. Yeah. They used to fucking go put this little. They yeah, do meet the fuckers. I think that was the whole. Yeah, yeah. but they <laughs> used to. <laughs> film as well. oh, dude, yeah. they used to legit like they, like used to rub like rum or whatever whiskey on the gums of teething babies. Yeah, go right, to sleep. Right, I chill yeah, out. I reckon yeah. that's a genius. I, well, it but is. You that's can imagine the overspill, like a guy like you know Daniel Plainview, just fucking pour a fucking. Well, I don't think you're pouring like a nip of whiskey into their bottle necessarily, are you? Or is it mixing it with milk? Is it no, like? But a I just hot think it would if it was just such an open ended. Um, oh, a bit of dash of whiskey never hurts, and you're giving it to like an infant. Yeah, true. Wild. Just a Wild side days. note, we also have Baileys. I just wanted to put that we, out. Do we? Oh, fuck yes. <laughs> oh, Baileys. Oh, I might have a Baileys while we do Titanic trivia. Yeah, I think That'll that's get nice. me in the mood. Yeah, yeah we'll do a half Fucking oath. You guys Shout got your, to na Baileys. your nightgowns ready with your Baileys? No, that actually not a bad I feel like they go should, together quite they well. Do. Like it's quite a they, night well, drink. I, I talk, nightcap. Yeah, it's a nightcap, a Baileys. Because the milk in there just sort of lulls you to sleep. It, it brings you back to when you were an infant, but you also got the alcohol in there that just... Yeah. <laughs> 100%. Keeps working. You know, yeah, it works yeah, over. Yeah. Good stuff. Good for the soul. God, I oh, love we'll that. It was one of the first alcohols that I stole off my older sister. Well, because you know it's what I mean? so drinkable. Yeah, yeah, she had it there, and I was like, what is this? Yeah. Tastes yeah. so good. Yeah, and you're like, oh, okay. Like, this I'm, thing's fantastic. And, like, as a young kid, you're like, you want to pretend beer's your favourite drink, but really, you're like, well, give me a fucking Bailey's and a Rusky. You know oh, what mate. I mean? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, no, yeah. I, lo I love Ted. So yeah, you're like, yeah. No, you, no, you don't. Do no, you don't. Do you know I do um, now, but... <laughs> they've got Vanilla Coke Cruises. At yeah, the right. Moment, and they good. are fucking delicious. Vanilla Coke Cruises. Vanilla Coke Cruises. I had uh, My sister-in-law gave me one on a Sunday, and I was like, you're kidding. There's These nothing are. better. Even those it's hard so solos, good. dude. I had a hard solo the other day at... Uh, Not bad. Know, was it Hickey or... Uh, Not bad. Bucks, and I was like... Team ads. I was like... 
Holy shit, this thing's... No. You can barely even taste the alcohol. Yeah. You're like, no wonder they had to change the no, name. No, but when yeah. we... when you, I think you bought a case of, to one of the golf trips, a case of cruisers. It was like Ooh. on the first day and it was hot. And then you're like, why oh, is out the cruisers? No, give me a, a warm beer, please. But you actually have a, a cruiser and you're like, this is actually perfect for outdoor yeah. activity drinking. Yeah, I yeah, yeah, big time. They're too sugary, they're too I sugary, reckon. Yeah, yeah, I reckon they're too sweet, the Yeah, cruisers. they get yeah, that's one the two. point. You don't want to get all bogged down in yeast of like... No, but... <laughs> Just like, but just too sweet. Like, just too sweet. If you no, can no. find a, le- a, a yeah, sweet Yeah, it depends spot. which one you get, though. I think the thing is, it's like an esky drink of, like, you want to bring it to the party, but you don't want to be stuck at the party with only fruity cruisy yeah. diet. No, no you, you don't, don't drink but him all day. he's definitely there a dancing, around doing the his things, and then you have a few drinks with him, a few chats with him. But Listen that's how his life but is. But again, just, I mean... Obviously, I'm pro Bailey's, and I'm in Bailey's corner, and I'll, I'll defend Bailey's to the cat. Well, he's a cool cat. But that's where Bailey's comes into its own because it's so drinkable. It's yeah. so delicious. I just it's can't s- stop listening to him. Yeah, yeah. It's, you know. You like, have my attention. Like, yeah. if, if he asked me, <laughs> this is how much I trust Mr. Bailey. If he said to me, if he knocked on my he's door so hot, late at night and said, can you come out to the woods and help me bury a body, I'd probably go with him. Yeah, you would. Well, you, you just know what go, I mean? As long yeah. as you bring your sweet teat out and I start <laughs> sucking on it, I'll do anything you want. As long as you flop yeah. that teat out, is I'm going to suck. Is your hot cousin Frangelico coming? <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, she can come. <laughs> she can come for sure. Yeah, for Angelico ain't bad. Look at this. This is not as walkover as as people were predicting. Yeah, give it not some minutes. Well, I know. True, not yet. But I mean, it just I, like it hasn't looked too. Again, I haven't been paying as much attention, but it hasn't looked too like. Uh, it looks like it's been pretty back and forth. I did say in the green room, fucking Broncos at four bucks is a price. Yeah, it is. That's for, for the fucking grand finals last year. When you think about the fact that the Panthers are also without James Fisher Harris. Correct. Oh, oh, then that happens. oh then that happens. beautifully done. That was Bush League. Yeah. I tell you what's crazy though. Like you think about your Moses M by teams, Tigers, Dragons, Doggies, and you're like, is there ever a way up? Remember when Panthers had like Luke Walsh and shit? Like yeah. those days yeah, where you're yeah, like, Jared days. <laughs> the and you're like years. you can turn it around. Oh fucking oath you can. <laughs> well, you just like, need to basically <laughs> capture an entire the entirety of Western Sydney in your junior base and just funnel them all in. You yeah. see a funnel. Well, it's just such a people from Penrith. It's such a culture shock when you go there. People like it's. They wouldn't move if you gave them a $12 million home on the water at Watson's Bay. Well, no, but I think it's people, you know, people like you. You like what you like. You like where you're from. Yeah. No, and I'm, I'm saying power to them. Like, it's, that's, it's, a, rich, it's a rich community area of, of yeah, robbers. Yeah, but they used to be shit for a while. Right. Back in yeah. The day. Like, oh, no, they sucked. They suck. shit. Yeah. Paul Aiton was like their best player. And listen, Paul Aiton could, you know, <laughs> he's a, I think he's a Papua New Guinea international. So, I mean, I don't think that we want to turn our nose up at the great Paul Aiton. But I get what you're saying. Travis Burns was out there. Soward? Oh, well, no, Maybe Jamie was no, good. Jamie's a premiership that, winner. That's when they were... Origin player. But that, they had a good up. good little run there with Maloney and Soward, didn't they? They got to, like, yeah. prelims. Yeah, well, like, I think when Maloney... Yeah. Like, it was Soward was there, then Maloney was there. And when Maloney was there was on, like... was when Cleary came in, and I think it was sort of like... That was the revamp years. Like, how many years after Maloney left did they win the comp? But they made it to a prelim. Two. They made it to a prelim the years Three. the Bunnies won, I think. So that's when they turned it around. We did 2014. They, they versus the dogs in a prelim, I think, in 2014. No there. way. Did they? No. So, sometime around First there. First try. Oh, hold on. That's it. 2014. Taruva. There we go. They did. There you go. There Taruva. Taruva. That's right. That's right. Fuck. That's right. Yes. I actually said Taruva first try score. And I, I was like, it's too, it's too soft. And I my bet. It's yeah. too soft. If Penrith put 13 on, which is looking likely, let's be honest. Yeah. Then Edward Simpson just walks into another pet. Yep. Mm. You know yeah. So I mean? you just, what, you're 13 plus yep. and Taruva, I'm Taruva and Taruva, yeah. Panthers only get 20. The only team to get 20. Only team to get 20. Yeah, I don't oh, that. that's yeah. not that's bad. Still, we, can, yeah. we can both win. Yeah. We can yeah. both win. I, um, and start to put some fucking space between us and the Does it shock anyone the, the moment I remark about how <laughs> evenly poised the game is that it becomes yeah. not evenly yeah. poised? Yeah. We said well, it was wait, a big call 15 <laughs> minutes in, wasn't well, it? Well, you've got to, uh, you can only call it on what you see, I said, at the moment. Well, it's the, steam, well the steam needed to come out of the game, Tom. The steam. The steam hadn't come out. The steam it had just come hadn't out. come out. I'm just going to throw quickly to Maddie the Water Boy, who is a bit of an insight. Does he have a mic? I don't know. If I don't he has know, a mic. but I'm just going to I'm going to ask you a question, Maddie. Between Maloney leaving and Penrith winning the comp, how many years? 
Two years. Two years. Which is what I said. Also, for those of you, Matty the Waterboy. Yeah, till they made the grand final. Okay, so three till they won, two till they made the grand final. There Matty we go. the Waterboy uh, dutifully filling in for the one and only Tommy Tobler, who on holidays. Yes, and he will be drowning gifts for doing so. And by gifts, I mean money. You mean Matty? Yes. Yes. I thought you were saying Tobler. Jeez, I'm like, Matty. Mm, definitely not Tobler. <laughs> Tobler goes to more holidays than my mum. Yeah, <laughs> I, look. Tobler no. goes to Vegas and comes back and needs a holiday. <laughs> In fairness to Tobler, he hasn't. No. He has not been taking his his twenties. <laughs> yeah. No, no. yeah, the yeah. kid's been working. He works. He's been he working. Works. His, he works. He's been working his peroxide. In fact, penis I haven't seen bone. more pe- anyone work as hard as Tobler. If I'm going to be honest, I love Tobler. 2019, he was it. Okay. So okay, year after. Thank so the year you, after Maloney left, they made the grand final. Maloney's like like. Yeah, there's win multiple premierships. He's a winner though. He's like an OG ring like ring wraith ring ring chaser like. Warriors, GF. Roosters, did he win one? No, with Roosters. He didn't play for the Roosters. Yeah. Did he? Oh, yes, he did. No, he did. He won one. He won it with the Roosters. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Sorry. Roosters, my he made a grand yeah. final with the Warriors. He uh, won it with the won Roosters. Roosters. Won with, won the, with the, Sharks. the Sharks. Won with the Sharks. And made and Penrith turn around. Penrith turn around. Like, well turned Penrith Panthers. around. Like, he was one like, year away. That's it. Like, if you got a res just with one team, it's like, okay, that's just that one team sick. But Maloney's like, no, Maloney's I'll animal. pitch my tent here and we're going to make the GF. Yeah. He's, he's like, a GF guy. No, but he's like when big corporations like sign a gun for hire, like a change agent who comes in and like just completely. Audits everything. Their, yeah. Audits everything, revamps all of their <laughs> shit imagine, and then leaves, gets them back to fucking surplus and bounces. Being, being a workhorse. Oh, uh, Cleary. Regarded as a... Oh, Dylan Edwards. Oh, Dylan. Cleary give and Dylan it, Edwards. Give it. Oh, oh, you give... Oh. Wrong guy. Oh, was, oh, oh, he's oh, lost, he's lost it. it. Oh, no, we're on. We're still on, are we? No, he's lost it. He's lost it. Uh... Where being, the fuck was being the a fast workhorse post? or like oh he's a workhorse or he's a he's yeah, a sprinter yeah. or he's a uh, try scorer he's a he's a GF guy. Cleary's got some toe. Look at that. <laughs> he's very G- few would have a GF guy yeah. well, like, in your team. You can like, take it GF one guy. you can take it one step further. He's a winner. He also had a he's also won a has sh- he won a shield? Origin, yeah. Yeah, 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 for sure. Well, that's mad. So the guy's a fucking stud. Nathan motherfucking Cleary there. Just look, I was watching the Maddie and Cooper show. He's a GF guy. Maloney's like a, oh, a, fuck yeah. a bron in Game of Thrones. Like he doesn't he doesn't have a house that he's always been in, but like he's a sell sword. He's a sell sword and he goes sword. around and he fucks people up. Who? Like Maloney. Yeah, yeah, he's, yeah, a yeah. Mate, he's a sell yeah, yeah. sword. He's a sell sword. Like that's all it is. He's a gun for hire. Yeah. He's a mercenary. Yeah. Which is so dangerous. A mercenary when you, just, that when, won. You, when you act on your own accord, yeah. he's just like, well. I owe no yeah. one nothing. Yeah, and but Sil- myself. Seppo just earned his first techie, surely. <laughs> That's <laughs> a, a It's a great point. <laughs> Cleary already on thirty-five for those playing super. Oh, did coach. I captain him or did I switch it to? Oh, oh bit listen, of push and shove. Cleary reeking of a hundred tonight. Yeah, I'm just and putting fucking that out there. He's reeking of a hundred. Turbo, because oh, he doesn't get it. Because he doesn't get a bit of. What's bro- going on here? Like What's going on here? Bit of push, bit of shove, bit of PNS time. Bit of PNS, bit of push and shove. I, I tell you what I think we'll need to do, Tom. Yeah. And this is just this is just my content brain just working through. Yeah. I think we got some text idea. coming through as well. Uh, I think you know. that we need to sit down and do a live stream of us watching Titanic with Cody. Yep. Certainly. You know what I mean? And I can just quote the whole thing for yeah. you, buddy. What's the what's the what's the what's the are we on ketamine or is it a that's a joke, ladies and gentlemen. It's a joke. That's a joke. It's <laughs> a joke. Big fat joke. Big fat joke. Um, we will have some text coming through. <laughs> went, went down like the Titanic. <laughs> <laughs> what are the texts? Well, I don't know. Read them out, mate. Well, you got to put them across on the sheet. We all know you got them. Ah, uh, well, you guys work out how to get them on that sheet, and then we'll do them. Copy paste them in. That's what I mean. I want yeah. to. I want to watch it again. Um, even you just, can come just, if you want, well, buddy. Just, no, just privately, I feel like on a scat Sunday, I love... I tell you, on scat Sundays, or whenever it is that you scat, you know, just a little bit Doesn't sick of the world. Doesn't need to be Sunday. You're... Like, I don't really... I was saying this at um, T's wedding. Just like, like, oh, put on Finding Nemo or some sort of like... It actually makes me sick watching something like oh. that. I need to watch something with a bit of like... No, it's too... On the edge drama it's too to dialed mirror down. Yeah, how yeah. I'm feeling Oh, inside. so you need a bit of etchness. Yeah, I need a bit of etchness on my scat. It depends. Reese Walsh is off the field. Yeah, he was. He went off for an HIA. But he's done. No. Like, like imagine what Is he out of the game? Shame. <laughs> That's what I was. That's the exact movie Sim did to me. Reese Walsh out of the a game. Staff party. He's like, you have to watch this when he was living with us. Oh, he lived oh okay. In a cat. And he made me watch oh, Shame okay. with him when I was scat. 
And I'm going, why are you, uh, finish me, why are you making me watch this movie? <laughs> Would you watch Shame. Shame? Yeah, Michael Fassbender, sex addict, coke addict, kind of like suicide it's, shit. Is that why you watch that? Because Sim was forcing me to do nah, it. No, that's ridiculous, Sam. No, that's a Simmy, <laughs> yeah, Timmy, not the right I've got to side with Simmy there. I just, there's something about my sicko it's brain that, that aligns with Simmy's where I just need to watch something that um, is... You guys are like actors, edge. you know what I mean? Like no, you guys no, like it's to got nothing enjoy to do with the performance. No, that's the creaking up the boards. Yeah, it is. No, I'm like, I'm not Finding a Nemo, Nemo guy, fuck but off. I am a nineties action dude. Everyone knows that. Like, give me Harrison Ford trying to kill uh, Gary Oldman, believe it or not, as a Russian on Air Force One. Like, give me that sort of <laughs> yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, or Harrison Ford the, trying the to get away from uh, Tommy, Tommy Lee, Lee Jones. Tommy Lee Jones and Gizmo. Yeah. Um, Oh no! Give me fucking all, like all Harrison of that. Harrison Ford trying to what, Harrison oh. Ford trying to get away from uh, oh. Sean Bean when he's an IRA guy. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me let me see if this aligns with you a little bit better because Shame's actually a terrible example. It's maybe too edge, but a movie like sci-fi thriller like Arrival, when you're scat, Arrival? sometimes can be like oh, no, it's too is... good to be scat. I want to, no, but I, I, but I, that. but I froth that good. shit though. The same. Like, like aliens that's, that's, coming to Earth. You know who did Arrival? Fucking hooked that to my veins. Arrival, June Dude. guy. Yeah, yeah, I know. I yeah. knew. I knew. Oh, yeah. Arrival was a good movie. Arrival he's actually, was, oh, he's yeah. actually, he's, Oscar, he's got Oscar quite the, the repertoire. So people are trying to say like. Chrissy Knowles, obviously Chris. the director of our generation, but they're going, old mate Denis mm. is like coming up. The Frenchman the, that could. Yeah yeah, 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 fuck yeah. couple of questions here. I don't... Uh, Favourite rugby league movie, Footy Legends, Final Winter, Chasing Comets. I don't... Couldn't tell you. ...have one. Honestly, I've never seen any of them. Everyone says Footy Legends. Because Matt, everyone, is that what every, Matty was in? No, well, everyone's going to blow up about... Isn't the that isn't Arne Doe in Footy Legends? Yeah, I feel like Matty Johns in it as well. Yeah, Maddie's in Johns is one of them. He's in one yeah, of them. Yeah. Chasing Comets was, I think, made by uh, Jason Stevens, the former Sharkies player. I've never seen a single one of them. Neither have I, and I'm just going to be honest with you. And that was from Neil Southern over cash in. Sorry, Neil, so great also, to see you in Vegas. is it true Arndo doesn't actually paint his own paintings, or is that a... Is that a who? No, I don't think... Is don't, that a shocking Listen, rumor? I don't want to... I don't. I've heard that he has people come in and help. Or I've heard that he cakes on so much fucking paint that eventually gravity... Oh, has its way. Yeah. You can't but I mean, like, fuck, home. I'm not hating on him. The cunt can paint. No. Kid can paint. Um, now, what's another one here? Uh, Tom, do you find it strange that Cogger and Jock Madden are both coming to the NRL halfback position the same week? Yes, I do find that weird. I am on them for a uh, anytime try score a multi that's paying $52, just so everyone knows. Good for you, mate. Good for you. Seven needs to look down the barrel of the camera and thank the missus for going the big lift. Yeah. Yeah, uh, Millie, and anyone who has a partner, either with or without child, uh, you just got to realise that as much as I'm... Where's my camera? There's your camera. Yeah, I was in the right camera yeah, street. Oh, sorry, man, I thought you were looking at You've been in one room with one camera before, you know what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> Break and these chains. Once they have kids, they truck more nut than any actual fucking web keys. Uh, Nutleys, all that stuff. So <laughs> thank you, Millie. Uh, I'm going to come home and I know I'm going to be in a, a world of hurt yeah. and I'm going to try to relieve you from your world of hurt. Um, but you just got to go, your missus goes to another level because we always go, you know, we fought in wars, we're hunter-gatherers, we're strong, women weave busters. No, they give child <laughs> birth to children <laughs> and that's a way harder thing than anything anyone does. Well, I tell yeah. you what would be good and well said, uh, well yeah, said. Absolutely. Well done, mate, well done. You well should, I, I thought think, that was going in a different direction. And, yeah, yeah, so no, right. That's awesome. That's um, awesome. Just quickly, the number again, 0438 144 593. If you want to call for a chat, uh, what if you were to have some techie, right? I'm just putting it out yeah. there. Then the, the, the techie on your breath might actually lull them back to sleep. Oh, yeah. As we mentioned yeah. earlier, go old school. <laughs> Fume them. Go old school. Yeah. Fume them. Maybe lick your lips and then lick theirs. Something like that. You know what we're I not, mean? We're not encouraging that. We're just saying that don't Bit of techie off the gum onto theirs. Bit of ouzo. You yeah, know, good night. Yeah, that's great. And that's if there's two, a bit of extra for good measure. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, clearly. I'll Let's take it up a try, baby. Um, Here we go. Defense, defense, try time. Try time. Try time. Easy, time. easy, easy peasy. Third lemon plus. squeezy. That's the modern version. This is okay. done here. This is going to be an absolute Let's humping Let's, now. Why am I Let's clapping? Uh, Let's clapping. Uh, uh, Let's clapping. Uh, uh, yeah, I actually don't really care. Why am I clapping? Well, hang on. Actually, no, it's, another, it's just it's plus ten or eight and a half. My money is on ten and a half. But what's your actual bet? Uh, plus eight and a half, Dylan Edwards. So I need him to score some points, the Broncos. Yeah. I tell you what, I have like a weird relationship with Targo scoring because last year I needed him to score and he 
got me short three unit scoopers. Just him. Just him. Just him. So it's kind of like, you, it's like you're in high school and you've asked a girl out. She said no. And then all of a sudden, well, maybe she likes him now. It's a new semester. And you ask her again. She says no. You know what I mean? I just yeah. can't. I can't be happy for her ever. I can't be happy for him. It's no, so I get it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I feel like Tango is always where I'm yeah. not when I'm trying yeah. to bet on him. He's always yeah. where I'm I, not. I love him, but him and I... Our relationship ain't going. Taruva's, yeah. Taruva's starting to get the, the Khan Pereira's about him. Through, you're starting through a to get there like Tigers throw 800k at him for some reason because he's got tries. Well, but I mean, just from a gambling yeah, yeah, perspective, yeah. you know yeah. how AK, uh, yeah. Carney. Uh, Carney Pereira last year, he just would turn yeah. up for the boys? Yeah. Rain, hail, or shine. Yeah. Like turn yeah. up for your mates sort of yeah. stuff. Taruva's starting to Taruva's do that. Taruva's starting to do that. Is he, is he kind of got a bit of a mistake in him alongside the brilliance on the other side well, of the sword? No, it's kind of like if Carney P good? was a feature on a pokey machine, Taruva's the subby. You know <laughs> yeah. what I mean? Like, <laughs> he's the line of subbies just yeah, going, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 Trying link to pad your my, work. Link my other shit up, yeah, dude. Yeah, 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 link me up. <laughs> link me up, buttercup. That's just cherry ripe, black yeah. dot stuff from Nathan Cleary. The Ooh. chin. The chin. the chin. Okay, ten two. Penrith. Uh, Brisbane looking flat. Flat as a regular. Walsh off, not great. I was saying the number wrong. Oh four eight three one four four five nine three. Text or call. Well done, Tom. Thanks, mate. Brilliant, mate. Yeah, Appreciate you. Sebo off for a wee wee already. Jesus Christ. What are, What are your thoughts on Nathan Cleary? He's um, fucking great. Uh, of course, but like uh, the kids are late. I think he's a. Cleary, 60 I, points I like him. through I think it, fucking, what, 20 minutes? Just so you know. I like the Reese Walsh passed the HIA. He will be back. Thank Christ. Sorry, Ham, what are you no, saying? No, just, just simply saying you like not him? much at all. Just saying I like him. If you it's like sparking Nathan? any seeds of thought in your own brain, well, listen, feel okay, free to listen. expand. Yeah, okay, thank you for that. I appreciate the, uh, the offer to expand. I also like Nathan Cleary. Funnily after, enough, so do I. Yeah, after his game three, it sounds, it it just sounds holds almost like... Well. Um, ungrateful in terms of like what you're saying after that game after his third premiership last year like the way he pulled that out of the fire you're like you just he's he's got a pass for the rest of his life in terms of just being an absolute fucking weapon there was something that the commentators said last week when they were playing that um i can't remember, to remember who it was the english fella who has his own podcast james guys graham know? yeah james Byron. graham who's very uh perceptive was saying he has this elusive um ability to to not um, give any telltale signs, not um, about project what he's doing about what do. he's doing. So mm. he keeps his head locked on, like eyes ahead, but he doesn't even move his head. And then in the last second, does yeah. put the ball where it Maddie is. And, Maddie but and that's hard to do when you're running zigzag sideways. Matty Johns and Cooper Cronk were analysing this portion of his play against uh, the Eels uh, on their show, where... He kind of got the ball in a, not a nothing position, but just like in a, it didn't look like anything was going on. And he didn't look like he was doing much. And then he's tucked the ball under his arm, looked at his defender and just fucking run at him. Oh, oh Dylan! Oh, oh, sorry. No, that's, uh, that's I mean, Mitch Kenny. That's not Mitch a double move. That's a try. He, no, bounced, that's a try. he bounced. He bounced. That's a try. That's a bounce. That's a 20 plus only. That's a 20 plus only. Shit. Look at this. Broncos, you suck. You fucking suck. Starting to get Sorry. fucking Broncos carved just up. spent way too long talking about how they weren't going to talk about the grand final. It was just absurd. It was. I mean, like... But it's like saying, think of anything but really an is. elephant. Yeah. yeah. You know what and I mean? Exactly. If you're saying, let's not talk about that grand final, that's going to make double you Double movement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Double yeah. movement. In the head sort of stuff. Movement. I answer double movement here. Don't hook the ball. Don't hook the ball. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> does he, does he, pr- does does he promote it? Or is he just... Or does he bounce? He's on the ground. He's holding him. Bang. Yeah, oh, double move. Is the movement. ball down? That's a double move. Is the ball on the That's ground? A, it's bounces. the ball carrying arm. It's it not bounces. the ball. He bounces. Oh, is the ball carrying no, look arm? Look at him promote. He Momentum bounce. Uh, and you know what? Bounce. It's tough. I think it's a double movement, but I could. The what are they saying? Uh, Jesus Christ. I'm already on the next turkey. This is fun. Yeah, I wouldn't mind a little tick. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Someone get me a glass. Clip that up. Uh, clip that up. Clip that up. <laughs> clip that up. He wouldn't mind a little turkey. It's been a long time. Yeah. Been a long time. It's been a long time. Been a long time, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look, I kind of yeah, don't mind if they it. give that. Give it. <laughs> no, don't give him no. Give him a real one. Poor bastard. I'll help him out. I'll yeah, you go him. help him out. I wouldn't leave the street. Yeah. 
Don't leave Street in charge. You'll hear the, you'll hear the fridge basic. fall over in the background. Try time. Oh, they gave it. There you go. That's fair. I think that's fair. Oh. People were musing, Sebo, about whether was there a chance that when you went to the toilet, you actually just went to slam a couple of techies. They just they just want techie Seb so bad. Yeah, but like, A, you got to work into stuff, and B, anyone who wants to understand anything in life, fucking just go watch Attitude Era Wrestling. Do you come out straight away with a techie? You got to work your no, way into No, it's true, you do. Dude, like, Reese Walsh's face looks fucked up. I don't like that. I don't like ruining a handsome boy's face. Give me some ice, please, Ed. Sebo? Sebo? Just wait. We, I want to cheese What's you. What's that? Like a fucking quadruple? Jesus no, it's a Christ. big block of ice. Oh, okay. Okay. Now, just wait. I want to give you a big old cheers. Oh, Look at his face, dude. His f Look at the size of that thing. Can we see your face, Reese? Turn to the camera. 13.38 is the time on the clock, punters and dribblers. I'm sure you're ahead of us. This internet in our studio is getting progressively worse. Well... But sometimes a black eye and a hot boy makes them look hotter. A black eye? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 oh fuck yeah, it does. does. Um, but not when the scoreboard's looking shit, you're just getting your ass kicked, though. Yeah, too, but everyone right? knew that this was going to happen. That's why you put... But how bad could this go? 16-2. You know, you, you also look like... You know, Reesey... No Painey, no Adam. Yeah, yeah no I internet. mean, you're always up against it. No internet. Yeah, that's the toughest well, that's one. True. That's he's good, one. man. Like, Reese's a fucking Thank you. star. He's fucking good looking. Even better with a black eye. Kid's talented. He's going to be okay. It's going to be all right. Penrith might just start playing a bit of fuck it footy now. Look at him. Oh, hey, look at these oh, they are. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. If Penrith offloaded more, they'd be the most lethal. Well, they are the most lethal team in the world. But they'd be more <laughs> lethal. They'd be I more reckon lethal. they'd win a couple of comps. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They might even win one. Yeah. Isaiah, yeah, wasn't he outstanding last Dude, week? Dude, that kick for a try was just such, yeah, like, yeah, ridiculous. exceptional, like, just But he can play in the play. centers. He can play in the centers. Well, I like think he, he actually used to, I think he maybe even debuted in the backs. He used to be just, like, a nothing uh, edge back rower But no, I think center. he even played in the centers. Yeah, I think yeah. he debuted in the yeah. centers. I, I had him in uh, super Isaiah, coach when yeah. he was, like, a cheapy. Yeah, I think yeah, that might be right. Yeah. Walsh's face feels like it's <laughs> fucked up. Do we cheers? Uh, oh, to Sebo. Oh, oh. Have we got the techie there? Father of uh. not one, but two. To, to Mr. To Sebastian, Sebastian, father of two. Well done. Oh. Uh, oh. Yeah. Do we just break a glass? Yeah. Watch your drinks. There's well, been a chip. Yeah, there's been a chip. There. Mine. Don't worry. It's all it's just mine. It's just streets. I mean, Burmo. But, but, you but mate, it. listen, to Sebo for getting out and about, for having a techie with his mates, for digging deep, for going the big lift, for sleeping yeah. fuck oh, all. Was it Sebo's? Just make sure there's no... This is such a <laughs> shit oh, you, did, you did not fucking chip Sebo's, did you? No, you chipped no, the fuck you out chipped of mine. No, you chipped that one. See that? Yeah, but so, that one was already... No, no, it was already chipped. Right. Listen, right. without much further ado... Drink carefully, Sebo, in case right. you mate. get some glass in you. Congratulations on two children. Thank you. Well done, mate. Night. Oh! oh yes, no. No. You don't see that out of wow. Tilly Bags. Humble pie for the ghost. You did when he started. Remember yeah. when oh. Dilly used to... What's going on here? He's gone off. His face is fucked. What? Are... Yeah, yeah, his face is fucked, dude. Let's, I was let's like, just listen for, listen for a second. What do you mean? Yeah, it took his eyes this off. This isn't the most important thing here. Let's go to fucking Walsh. It's like Gary Oldman when he did RoboCop. <laughs> <laughs> Great point. <laughs> Put some silver face paint on. Just not your best hit, Gaz. Yeah. We forgive you. Dude, that's, that's <laughs> fucked up. I don't think you put him back out. No, you don't. No, they've lost the game, so. Oh, oh that, that's a good that's tackle. A Is that? Defense. Jeez, that's a good oh, tackle. Read they read that. Even that was beautiful that stuff. He actually liked uh, breaking the Ips post recently, Brendan. No follow, though, but. Take it. Brendan, eh? Be a corrupt. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. So what's up with Reynolds? Why is he out? He's injured. Bad? It's his hamstring, is it? His knee. His knee. Mate, he's uh he's getting on. He's getting long in the tooth, Adam Reynolds. It's, it's this year or 
or not for, for in terms of winning with Reynolds, I reckon. Well, he's probably got yeah. one, another year, like yeah. maybe contract wise, but potentially. I just, I just, I honestly, genuinely, outside of Manly, who obviously win the comp, I, I don't see who beats Penrith outside of Manly who win the comp. Like it's, they just, they've got fucking Nathan Cleary, they've got incredible forwards, all like they just replace everyone they lose with absolute Balance. throbbers. They're balanced, Balance. mate. Yes. Like, everyone's like, oh, they they can't win without Coruscant. Well, yeah, they can. They can't win without Burton. Yeah, they can. They Kick can't out. win without Kicker. Yeah, they can. <laughs> like, it's just and on and on and on and on and on it goes. Four grand finals they've been in, mate. That is fucking no, outrageous. No, but the Dragons are the greatest establishment. <laughs> oh, what, when everyone was a fucking butcher without a salary cap? Like... Jesus Christ! Yeah, what are you yeah, talking yeah. Like, about? Like if you were if you were cutting meat <laughs> full time, yeah, right, yeah. and you played a bit of footy yeah. on the weekend, yeah. I don't count it. Yeah, like it's obviously you count it for the time, but it's not as impressive. Yeah, it's like Henry from fucking Glendale Butchery. You know, you're paying him 10k to be there. He's a giant guy up against some other plumbers. You know, you're yeah. gonna win ten in a row. Um, Penrith are the dynasty. Fucking team. Of, well, of they're, all, they're, they're, all they're, all they're the dynasty of our of our time for sure. They're elite. They're elite sportsmen. You know, and and it, it, I get the sense that there is a the chance that as as we get older, gentlemen, we get stuck in our own time warp. You know, yeah. like old, like our people. Cleary, that meat cleaver. <laughs> But I mean, <laughs> that old chestnut. But in the sense that, you know, when you talk to older blokes, no one played fucking footy harder than the blokes in the 80s. Yeah. No one played yeah. footy harder than Throwing the blokes in the 70s. Throwing Payne House and Greg is... Inglis and those two could beat them the whole team. Of, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, we're stuck in our time. Yeah, right, here we go. Oh, I missed it. Why am I clubbing so much for the... I don't know why I'm going for the... Well, you want a so tight game, mate. You just want a yeah, tight game. You want a like contest. Football. I feel leading the live stream I've done, it's never been a tight game. No, no, I was clapping that they defended. Except the Eels just... when the Pachunk happened. <laughs> Pachunk was... Well, well you yeah. got a Pachunk and yeah. that was a beautiful yeah. moment. Yeah. 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 yeah, everyone... I mean, you can only dream of being in a Pachunk moment. Oh, that was glorious. Not the Pachunk, now but the moment was felt so good up until that moment. Is Reese back... <laughs> Is Reese back on the bench there, or is he he's, out of the well, game? Or is he just sitting with the boys? You Surely did. he's out of the game. Can we get confirmation on that, Jens? Just check check your uh, your socials, your Twitters of the Don't, world. But, like, if I was a producer of NRL, I would be like, Reese, even if you want to sit in the bench, we just need that tunnel shot of you. Yeah. Like yeah. just walk up the tunnel because that's what shit start, everyone's talking about. You yeah, know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, like, That thing will pump on yeah. Twitter. Just on, walk up the tunnel and then yeah. literally turn around. We'll yeah. cut it. We'll, we'll clip it up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just let us clip this <laughs> yeah, up. Yeah, just clip let, it up. Yeah. Yeah, there's that, like there's like social media like directors out yeah, there yeah. going. We just yeah, need yeah. you to do this, mate. To Dude, pump so it up. Like, you know, so, you're so oh, true. that's a good shot. Hey, oh, there we hey go, it's just right. quietly. If they got rid of that fucking hot ass camera they had last year, remember after they scored a try and they go on the ground? And there's that real HD. I don't know. I've seen the one, the one, the one like this, that slow mo. No, it was like it was like 8K. Yeah, yeah, it was yeah, like yeah. you're right. You felt like you're in the huddle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was super nice camera. Maybe they just save that for like fucking bigger games. But you're like. It's a great point, so I don't know if I've seen it. I haven't it. seen it yet. Oh, go Ezra. I'm loving Ezra's braids. He couldn't even offload it. Fractured eye socket and concerned or delayed seems a concussion. Fuck, dude. His eye looks like it's fucking fractured. It look, it, well, I, was, I wasn't going to say socket, but, you know, it looks sockety. Doesn't look like the Broncos are holding any ill will after that grand final they weren't talking about all week. Looks no. like everything's cool. He initially passed the HIA, was about to come on, as per Matty the Waterboy Elite at his craft. Maybe concerns now about the socket on the man. Well, dude, when he came out, it was like, that eye looks fucked up. What's annoying me is that the cameramen have not got any close-ups of the eye yet. Again, if I'm in the director's booth, the producer's booth, my voice is hoarse from abusing the cameraman, saying, get me a close-up of that fucking eye. Yeah. Because yeah. like, you need that guy there. Socket, where's socket cam? This keeps fucking happening with Penrith. It happened last week as well. This fuck, uh, oh, like that's I a bit of rugby league. That's rugby, rugby league. league. That's, rugby league. that's a Parramatta soft cock win. That's rugby league. <laughs> that's rugby league. Yeah, you that's would say that. Problem. Until it happens to you. You're weak. Until yeah. it happens to you, you'll be going, that's, and that's fucking But that's why you haven't won comps, mate. Yeah. That's why you don't know how to win comps. When they say, like, your owners look like their dogs. Yeah. You look like your half <laughs> 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 we got penalised last week Clip for that, that and up. they didn't. That, that's the anyone who watched that game would know. 
What one of the f- one of the few many? I sound like a wizard. Yeah, you do. You listen, dude. No you one's everyone's, like tuned, everyone's tuned out of your excuse. You sound like an Eels fan, oh, fair bro. Enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Let's, like an Let's go, bro. Go six on. again. No, Let's go. Hold him out. Oh, forward. No, oh, he scored that. That was he's so fucked fucking. He's out. He's out. He's out. That was the first tackle. The first tackle, and they went for it. Penrith have brought hey, their Eddie, D, bro. Eddie, I'll, I'll bet you $100. Yep. Just you personally. Uh, no, for, for, no, for Saturday? No, no swing in. Fucking yeah. Fucking $100 one. $100 Eels beat Manly. Yeah, just, a, just a mano a mano. Well, this is like mano the 10th time we've done it. We've done, we've done this. We do yeah, this bet all the time. Yeah, and I time. always win. Well, we've won the last four out of five games, so I actually am up. There might be a close-up incoming because we're behind. The clock is saying 6 4 3 2 1 6 minutes to go. Internet issues. Oh, oh, there it is. oh bro. No, it's hideous. Oh. Get rid of it. He's oh, no, that man's, not, that man's not playing. That no. man's not playing. Well, he's Cracks on the bench. Skull. I haven't said he's out of the game. But, I mean, Are you, Why the fuck would you play him now? Round two, three. Kevin would have to have rocks in his head. Yeah, you're going to lose. Yeah, like they've lost this game. So why would you play him? Well, the thing is, I mean, I guess it's just on how you value, like, what they, like, do they feel like they have to win this game? I no, know you don't, don't have to. They, don't. Like, they can beat up any other side. You don't need to beat Penrith. You don't have to, but I Maddie mean, the water boy sent him photos. Maddie, fuck me, Dad, you're on fire, cunt. Yeah, he's he's good. Dude, he's elite. The kid's good. The kid's very good. And listen, we've got great producers behind the scenes, but what they're seeing right now is an elite veteran at yeah. work. Well, I mean, elevate, boys. They're seeing elevate. an elite veteran. What you do is you look, you relax, and you take notes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You try and elevate and reach, and you know, you need you need someone to chase. Yeah, you need someone to chase. Obviously, Matthew McConaughey, who likes to chase his future self, Matthew which is sort of which is, lame. Well, it's maybe the most arrogant thing I yeah. think I've ever uh, heard. My hero, who's my hero? Myself. Myself right in bro. 10 years. Yeah, you're right like, oh, bro. my God. I love you, like, McConaughey, but that's fucking absurd. McConaughey, we all love... For the People McConaughey sucked him off for that. I'm like, that's so shit. Too yeah. Hollywoody, you know what I mean? But if you're making millions of dollars surrounded with yes men, you start saying this shit. You start believing it. I and know. you're like, Matt, you were cool. You should just be in like all those cool movies. And then you had to, now you just fucking shut up. My hero. My hero. That's why he's won an Oscar. It's like, do you need to suck your own cock anymore? In a, in a white jacket. You've just in won a white jacket. jacket. You know what? I'm my, hero my hero is myself in yeah. 10 years. My hero God, his dad, years. and himself. Yeah. Okay. Move bro. over, Matt. Silly <laughs> Murphy's in town, motherfucker. Yeah, sorry, dude. Like, Kill him. Dude, he was telling, Eddie was telling us today uh, that Bradley Cooper... In, like, whatever the movie he did. Maestro. Yeah, his, Maestro. His nose movie. Yeah, but yeah. he spent, like, six years trying yeah, to, like, yeah, learn how to be a yeah. conductor, and then, yeah. like, conductors were yeah. like, this is he's not a loser. People have been... He's, he's not a loser. No, no, but, like, no, but, he, the no, but he was training for the Oscar. Yeah, like, that's it. He saw it as an Oscar. But at the end of the day, it's like the Oscar's just an award that a, bu- a small bunch of people vote for, and he's training for that, where someone like Cillian Murphy... I watch, in high school, I watched Wind Shake the Barley. Made me oh, cry. Oh, oh, that's too good. That's a, yes. that's a TA. Cleary. That's a TA, baby. Cleary, Yes, dude. please. Yes, please. If you've got the C on Cleary, you get rugby league no football. Oh, I'll get never it. forgive you, Matty. You, you suck it. Oh, is that 20 points? If you've got the C on him, you get rugby league football. Look at this. Yeah. Look at this. Look at this. Look, Look at Cleary, this. dummy uh, inside, dummy uh, inside. Uh, what? You're uh, elusive. Oh, 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 oh. Fuck, I should have kept good. Cleary. He's good. Ve- well, you don't get rugby league football. It's as simple as that. Look at this, Cleary. Look at this, yes. dude. Yes. Dummy inside. Of course I did. Look at his dummy head. Look at his head. Look at his head. He's not looking dummy, where he's going. He's not looking, ga- he's not look looking where he's going. Well, he sort of oh, was. It's but too it, easy. It's fucking elusive that's and it takes just, the hit. That's just... Let's put 50 on here, boys. Put my mind at ease. Jeez, you just don't get this on a ping, uh, p- ping sl- a poo slinger, do you? <laughs> no. Like, it's kind yeah. of like oh, uh, this, oh, this sort of rugby league? No. You do not get playmaking like oh, that. That man the, is you don't, just... You don't applaud. That's fucking glorious. Yeah, you don't. Gladiatorial. He's got it. He's just got it completely watch. fucking bamboozled. You don't yeah, have to Maestro watch Maestro was game. Oscar bait, uh, Arvin Mendoza. That's all it was. But so what, yeah. I was, what I was saying to Burmo today, Sebo, is that I've, uh, I've fallen into a bit of a TikTok rabbit hole whereby people that can play instruments, right, really well and have been conducted in the past try and play along with, like, well, how he's conducting and he's just not doing it right. And I'm like, six years spent doing what, mate? Yeah, but he's trying to, like... like you're going about it the wrong way. Yes. If you're going, I want to win an Oscar. But he, but he made out like he di- he became a, a he conductor. He didn't. He just put on yeah, a fake a nose and fucking moved some hands around. <laughs> tries to say he's the greatest actor, and he's in that movie where he just takes pill. Like, come on, like, 
Oh, <laughs> listen, Bradley Cooper's the man. I don't think we need to he's shit on him. He's the man in a but, way. Well, we're shitting on the performance. Yes. No, but he's I'm shitting sh- on the man. No, I'm shitting on the man turning... He's like clearly talented. We love him in his comedies, hangovers, wedding crashes, all that stuff. He's a good actor, but like he seems like he's one of those guys that just now is like... Desperate to desperate win an Oscar. Desperate to win an Oscar. Could, no matter could, which could, way, could, any way I can. Could, would it be fair to say this gentleman... Is is Bradley Cooper looking at his old mate Matthew McConaughey, who we, who we have shit on for having himself <laughs> his own hero, but he was a rom com guy. He was a he was a comedy rom com guy who who had an awakening, who went elite in True Detective and then took the fuck off, won an Oscar. Is he like this? Is I want to follow yeah. a, a chart of yeah, similar parts. There's like there's like Bradley Cooper's been like an actor nerd for ages as well. Yeah, he was like, in like the actor's studio. I, He's I'm a just, director. I'm just more like in for bat for my boy Cillian Murphy. Because because Wind Shakes the Bali, IRA film, old film, came out like 2004, loved it. Chrissy Nolan came out, because he's been in a few Chrissy Nolan films. Hates of Chrissy Nolan. And Chrissy Nolan goes, he's the best actor of our generation. He's been in the Batmans, like, he was no in one, Inception. No one gives him a leading role. First leading role he gets, what happens? Bang. Outside of TV, obviously. Yeah, outside of being Tommy Shelby, the greatest character in TV. Like, Speaking of shows I haven't watched. Yeah. Tony, <laughs> <laughs> Tony Soprano, I beg to differ. Yeah, but Tommy Shelby well, just... Well, of the, of the moment, of the moment, of the, moment, of the now, yeah, of the now. Yeah, I'm not oh, saying yeah. Peaky Blinds is like even a top 10 it's of all that, time, but that Tommy, that Shelby's, Tommy Shelby's a What do you mean? Cool it's still running. Peaky? Is it? Peaky is it Blinds? No, it finished. No, no, when did it finish? Like 10 years ago. Like a year or two ago. 10, like a year ago. First season came out about 10 years ago. finished. But I'm saying, but The Sopranos finished quite a while ago. It finished right? post- oh, shit, what, ages ago. I just think Tony Soprano's a better actor. That's my opinion. Gandolfini died like five yeah. years ago. <laughs> <laughs> Correct. Let's not get our pretzels oh, knotted. No, no don't knot them. <laughs> don't knot them. Don't get in a pretzel. <laughs> Well, you can not a pretzel. Yeah, you pro- have well, you, have you they seen Sopranos? They are not noted by <laughs> definition. Have you seen Sopranos? I've watched the first yeah, it's three it's or four seasons. It's, it's great. Amazing. It's great. I also, um, this splits the room on talking shows. That w- would include everyone. Yeah. Um, Friends or Seinfeld? Seinfeld, obviously. Friends. 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 And I know, it, I know it makes what you... What are you? Like are you friends or Seinfeld? S- no, I never watched Seinfeld because oh, okay. uh, I know it I makes like you Seinfeld, the dumber. But I feel like Seinfeld, people who like Seinfeld, and I liked it, but like people who are, use it as an identity are like yeah. way too yeah. snobby. That's yeah. what I'm They're saying. They're like, oh, what? Like, I'm like, both can be good. Relax. I like, I like, I like I, Seinfeld and I'll yeah. bat for it. Yeah. Simple as that. No, but people no, who but like Seinfeld like yeah, are often like, they always friends have to go. is shit. Yeah. Like, it actually was all right. Yeah, friends is like, but Seinfeld people always have to bring up episodes where friends, I owned every box set on DVD. Never bring it up. Never bring it up. No, yeah, like, yeah. yeah. It just you know rules I mean? for you. Yeah. just rules for you. Like it's like the time when Ross, you know, uh, can we get the... Uh, Spoke to his kid in the dinosaur shit. You know, Bailey's over there, please. Good. Um, these techies are hitting me. No. <laughs> <laughs> trailing up. Those techies are hitting me. A show dinosaurs. that, in terms of comedy, if you guys want to show, obviously you probably all know Eastbound and Down, Danny McBride. Vice Never Principles. Vice oh, Principles. That That's awesome. That's funny as fuck as I well. I started watching Actually, Barry. Barry comedies. I started watching Barry on the plane. Barry as well? Vegas. Barry is That's pro- a fucking interesting no, show. Barry is yeah. probably the most interesting show of all time where it's oh, you need to have a like super oh, dark you. but super funny. But it takes like a fucking turn because I watched the last season and I was like on gum. I had a few gummies. It was at the Avatar 2 time. A few gummies. And I'm going, is this the gummies? And I wasn't wigging out but going is this fucking like dark dark now and then and did it go full dark it, got, it, went, it went full dark and then there's this like yeah it just uh, Barry oh. is one of the best shows of all time yeah look at this oh man I would not be surprised if Reese has a fractured face here that was pretty fucked up are we okay yeah yeah let's try and reset the whole thing eh? we're behind Good call, Maddie. Kids on fire. All right, punters and dribblers. Get your fucking affairs in order. Now, punters yes. and dribblers. The only way that you can win. What are you going to win? You're going to win a white punters and dribblers hat. You're going to win a nut trucker hat. And you are going to win one box, which is a month's worth of good day. Say it again. What have we given away? You know, we're getting one white punters and dribblers. Yep. Uh, corduroy cap. Yep. 2024 membership. Yep. You're getting one nut trucker trucker hat. Yep. And you're getting one box, which is a month's worth yep. of good day daily multivitamin 
make smart decisions. You're also your you're also getting a horizontal season shirt. There's a couple, and you're getting a fucking horizontal season. Right, we got we got to start with a bang. We got to start with a bang. A horizontal season shirt. The only way that you win this. How are you gonna do it? Well, you call the fucking hotline. Are you gonna call the hotline? Oh four eight three one four four five nine three. Now. The problem is that the core well, loading is actually one of the well, great ball lakes of all time. I mean, listen, we'll take... We'll, let's... Mm. So you got to call in, you reckon? Yeah, YouTube, YouTube chat. chat. Let's, YouTube? let's go old school. Okay, let's go YouTube. Let's, let's go, go YouTube. old school. Fuck the, fuck the hotline. Now, as I make a Bailey's, I want... Just to I, reiterate one more time. Punters and dribblers hat. Yep. Nut trucker hat. Yep. Swing us that glass. Month's back, worth Eddie. a good day. And a horizontal oh, season yeah. shirt of which there is nothing quite as good. So we're all enjoying a Bailey's, gentlemen. Oh, yeah. my God. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Is oh, yeah, look at that is sensational. Look at that. I would Just love look. to be. I would love to be on a plane and look. hear that four seats up in, in, in oh, when we were coming back oh, When we were coming mate. back from Vegas, dude, oh, we were absolutely oh. murdering But there's these. a part of me that feels like Cheers. it almost might happen. But when this Cheers. was invented, you know how the Indians love, like, worship cows. I reckon mm. there would have been a cow. At what? Like, imagine if it just oh, like some squirt, like evolutionary squirt, yeah, cow, like a like a a messiah of sorts just squirted this thing out. Oh like, yeah, cool. no, no, someone squirted that out. Yeah. Let it let it cool down yeah, too, because cool yeah. I mean, you want it cool, you want it fucking delish. All right, Ed, let's get to it, buddy. What's the question, gentlemen? It's been it's been quite some time, obviously, uh, at least since September. I'm just going to give myself a little bit more because I'm a big Bailey's guy. Uh, but we're going back to 1912, obviously. The film that I'll be referencing is James Cameron's 1997 masterpiece. Yep. Okay. Highest grossing film of all time for quite some time. Starring the incomparable Leonardo DiCaprio mm. and Kate Winslet. Uh, the, f- the, theme, the, so- the theme of tonight, okay, the, the scene of tonight rather, will require a double-barreled answer. Okay. A double-barreled answer. You will be required to get both pieces of information right in a single sentence to make it easy for Matty the Waterboy. Double-barrel verbally, like it rhymes? Like, what's the double Two answers. So, like, multiple answers around the same theme, scene. So, you'll remember that Rose, who was fed up with life... Okay, pressured into living with a loveless marriage. Well, it was a lovely. It was a loveless. Uh, as close to as deranged as you could get. Well, he, well, I mean, Cal was deranged, as we know. Yeah, he was. It was a loveless. Uh, she was a fiance of a a bit of a sick puppy. Mm. Let's be honest. Open your heart to me, Rose. <laughs> <laughs> All of Philadelphia's society had been invited you. to the wedding. Yeah, a lot of pressure on that. Deny me. <laughs> A lot of pressure. And so she's feeling she's feeling the weight of the moment. She goes to the, the bow of the ship, and the stern of the ship, bow of the ship, stern of the ship, whatever, wow. and attempts to throw herself overboard. Jack saves the day. Instead of flicking him, a, flicking him a 20 for his services, they invite him to dinner because Rose is displeased, okay? Now, they're at dinner. They're having a great time. Jack, okay, who's from Chippewath Falls, in, Win- in Win- Wisconsin, Wisconsin. <laughs> all right, who's been living under a bridge, is whining and dining, and I would say 69ing some of the most, you know, uh, impressive, salubrious, powerful people in the world and doing a great job. Mm. Now, at the end of the movie, okay, at the end of the movie, Jack Dawson takes the hand of Rose DeWitt Bucata as... Her fiance and all the merry men of big, fat, fucking gluttonous pigs are uh, going to the smoking lounge. He's leaving to go back downstairs with his boys. He hands a note to Rose, does he not? He does. Mm. We remember that scene, do we? Yeah. Not? yeah. We all remember that scene, Pugs and Dribbles. Yeah. We remember that scene. The question tonight is... It's very simple, and it's to win the first of the year and a shitload of goodies. Yeah, a shitload of stuff. A swag. Where did Jack get the pen from, and what did the note say? Okay, you go tell Maddie the answer, Ed, if you haven't already. I'll monitor it. I'll yeah, monitor it. it. Oh, Why don't you, you just tell him so you can okay, continue can't. to talk okay. with everyone? Great point. All right, there you go. Uh, I guess we just marinate not around the answer, but just on Titanic no. itself, Sebo. Um, 
just a great film. You know, just oh, a it's great a great film. three hour thing. Like I, the last time I watched it was uh, when I got COVID with Millie, and we got COVID. And we go, fuck it, let's just drag the mattress out to the living room. Nah, get the dog. That's a nice get the thing mattress, to do. Let's just Titanic. And you know the scene that gets me every time? The thing that gets me every time? There's different scenes in different movies that gets me. But the one that gets me is when Rose is on the life raft and then she jumps back on. And then whatever that musical piece is there is, is she's running up the thing yeah. and Leo's running down the thing. Because it's it, for me, it's always about like those musical moments get you and then, then they finally meet and you're going like that and like Millie. You're so stupid, Ross. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, that, yeah. That, that, that's the moment for me. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> he, he, Seb, that is... Fuck, I couldn't agree with <laughs> you more about great, music. That's such a great, that's a powerful moment. Yeah, powerful. Like, that's the moment for me, right? What, like, what, what about when... Uh, like we have to pay yeah. homage to the fire technique who lit off in slow mo to James Cameron. The the fire, the flare but, that goes off yeah. in the background as that's going in a yeah. slow mo oh, jack. I'd, and you go, holy shit! I'd tell you what, other, staring into her eyes. Like there's moments like that, but like every, well, help, help goes hoping in the background. Not to switch movies, but in terms of moments like that. But everyone knows if you've seen Armageddon. If you haven't, you're an idiot. I watched it, we watched it in Vegas. Yeah. And then when 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 there's hands him a fucking playing and they're going burn and they're going on the spaceship and then they're going. Mommy, mommy, that salesman's on TV because he's pretending to be a salesman. That's not a salesman. That's your <laughs> father. And then when, <laughs> then, when they, then when they come back to and, Earth and, then a kid, and the kid's yeah, like running out The kid's out running in slumber uh, yeah, and yeah. then fucking permission to shake the hand of the bravest man I've ever met. Is that Armageddon? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Great yeah. movie. Uh, we have a winner. Okay. Chris Hope. Chris Hope. Chris Hope. A lot of people came in with Meet Me at the Clock, uh, Make It Count, Meet Me at the Clock, but I needed also the addition of who did Jack get the pen off? It was the unsinkable Molly, Molly Brown. Brown. Yeah, I, I thought okay. so. Okay. I thought so. So, well well done, Chris Hope. Hey. Well done, Chris Hope. Shut Hope. that hole in your face. What, that chick? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Pen? If you don't shut that hole in your face. The Roseanne That's chick. our men out the, there. That's our men yeah, out there. Well, it's that's also me. not the Roseanne. It's not Roseanne. It's not that Roseanne. is not who no. fucking played that. Well, she, she, yeah, she had the, uh, the, the way to count him in from the outside of the cutlery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she's a fucking She was great. Gee. She's new money. She's, she's, she's won an gee. Oscar. She's won an Oscar. For what? I think for Misery. Misery? I haven't seen Misery. But it's I'm fucked, dude. I watched that one day. That's Stephen King. I never know. Classic. When I first heard of Misery as a kid, I was like, that sounds too scary for me because it is I once watched at your house with your parents, Fatal Attraction, and I got really scared of that, like, oh, yeah. like yeah. Uh, yeah. who's the, the husband in that Harrison Ford, I think, as a charming guy no, who gets himself no, into it's not 40. Deep with her. That's what lies beneath. Which is also, again, but we're going back further if we're going there. Well, who's in Fatal Attraction? Is it like it's um, uh, it's it's like Glenn Close is the female, and then the guy's just like a river Michael wild. Douglas, isn't it? Fatal Michael Attraction. Douglas. Oh, maybe it's Michael. Yes. Douglas. Dude, we saw Michael Douglas Chris, and Catherine Zeta Jones in <laughs> Vegas. Oh really? Dude, we were sitting in a we were no, yeah, 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 we were sitting in a casino and serious? just standing right, right there, like you, me, like, you, literally there, and what? I just go, did they yeah. look? He looks, he looks, he looks old as fuck. Oh, Catherine, she Catherine still had it. She Catherine's still had it. Catherine's, Catherine's always going to have it. No, Catherine Catherine's had it. always going to have it. Catherine Catherine had it. Like yeah. Helen Mirren. Helen Mirren has it and she's like 85. We were talking about it. We were like, it. It. Susan Sarandon. I was like, or uh, Summer Hike. I was like, that. But, no, but Burma spot You can't like oh, Susan yeah. Sarandon. Oh. I love Susan Sarandon. Looks like your mum, but. Oh! Walked into that. Walked into that. He walked She's into that. He's fucking redhead, you No, psycho. but the same vibe. No, the same vibe. That's just... I can't anymore. She's gone now. She's nothing like my mother. Uh, but uh, Just a bit of, housekeep, bit of housekeeping. Chris oh, yeah. Hope, you need to email turbo at hellosport.com.au. Correct. Well Burma, done, Chris. Burmo's mum's always reminded Don't me you talk of about Gold, my mother Goldie Horn. Goldie, Goldie Horn. Horn. Yeah, but Susan Sarandon and Goldie Horn acted in that movie Goldie together, Goldie Horn right? is blonde, you fucking idiot. Yeah, but it was that same movie about like two I'm chicks. I'm saying Goldie were... more likely with... Uh... Goldie closer to my mother. Yes, next time I come on here, I'll come with some Armageddon all right, trivia. Your because mum's that's... Goldie Horn, all right. Oh, fuck up, God. I'm Goldie. My mum's Goldie Horn, who was, who was the actress in... Uh, uh, she's like the football movie? Uh, Amanda Bynes? Is it Amanda Bynes? No, sir, um, what? Uh, the Longest Which Yard... One? She's no. have you you know Amanda Bynes? No. In the in that what was that football movie called? No. It, She's it, the man. Oh, oh, you, oh mean, yeah, yeah. You mean yeah. football? She. I, I came across her TikTok profile the other day. Wow. 
Are you a talkie now? You mentioned it a couple times. Oh, well, yeah. I, yeah, well, like, yeah. I, I'll be honest with you. I put my hand in, yeah, in the yeah, air. It's yeah. addictive as fuck. Yeah, fair enough. I, I haven't opened it. So. Super for mate. It's a wormhole you don't want to get into. Yeah. Honestly, like there's there's gems in there, but there's a but lot of bullshit. I tell you what wormholes that I'm not in, but I love getting at certain times. So after your bucks, right? So your bucks was in Palm Beach and I was running late. I was going to get a fucking train up or whatever. Millie was out of town. She was overseas, I think. So I ended up getting an Uber, 100 bucks or whatever. Put bets on horses. Like, yeah, I paid for this whole Uber. Go up there <laughs> and then get off our head at your bucks or whatever. I was like, oh, Seba, you can sleep on the floor, whatever. I'm like, I'm a guy who just can't do that shit. No. Look, I've, I, look, I'm just going to fucking order the Uber at 4 a.m., 5 a.m. <laughs> and just get back to Clavelli. Like, I'm just going to figure it out. Big lift from yeah, you, buddy. I'll just do it. And the next day I woke up and I'm like, okay, like I'm fucked and Millie's going to be back in like a week and I'm going to propose to her then. Like, I just need to go just somehow relax on this Sunday. And I went to Clavelli on the concrete and passed out. And I went down, bringing it back to the wormhole I went down in is YouTube video essays by nerds. <laughs> um, so I was lying there. Oh. I was lying there with my air- AirPods in, listening to some nerd tell me about everything I missed in June 1. Just, just fill me in, dude. Oh, what oh, did oh, I they, miss? They speak up. Yeah, no, up. no, but like they do like an hour. Like it's almost like they've written an essay. So they're not doing like a podcast or someone. But they're just going, here's what June 1's about, really. And you're going, oh, fuck. Like I've missed half the fucking it, point of this movie. Is, isn't, it, like, isn't it so special? <laughs> I've seen sort of things like that with um, with Alien Covenant and stuff. Yeah, where, yeah, yeah. Where the person making the video doesn't assert themselves into the video. They yeah. basically just write writing and then yeah. just show shit and from the clip. You get a Quickly, deep fellas, sorry, so we good. are back underway in the second half. We are at 38 minutes and 47, 46, 45, 44. 43, 42, 41, 38, 40. I find, like, there's, you know, everyone listens to sport podcasts a lot and all that stuff. Um, Thank oh, I certainly hope so. Different thing. <laughs> different thing. But, but if you like your thrones, if you like your shows and stuff, I've found, like, the ring of these two nerd chicks. Like, you, there's podcasts out there where every Game of Thrones episode that comes out, you listen to these two chicks talk, and you pick, they pick, they tell you all the fucking shit that goes <laughs> over all our heads. And yeah, it, right. And it makes the experience better. So now when Thrones season comes around for me, it's like, it's not like, think about the NRL season. You're just watching the game. But the NRL season to a lot of punters out there is listening to Hello Sport, NRL 360, all that stuff. So I don't know if they listen to us for too much analysis. No, but, like, yeah, but, well, but they uh, but like, who, no, who's got a new it. shinny? Yeah, 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 who's got a new and shinny? And so there's exactly. all this shit around what that, that sort of world and it <laughs> fucking opens it up, dude. It yeah. opens it up. Yeah. It opens it up. Yeah. It opens it no, up. I get that. Yeah. That makes sense. It's actually the way you put that makes a lot of sense where I was thinking like, fuck, could I even give a rat's ass about listening to a podcast about Thrones? Then it's like, I listen yeah, to Matty Johnson, could. Cooper Cronk, yeah. Breakdown. Of course, you up and on the of course I could. I listened no. to a, a podcast on um, Succession, and this is not the same thing. No, but no, but it is. Similarly, of, um, like a, 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 a at least the interviewer was a very, like, a uh, English... Uh, it's like a very savant of what the subtext was, and she actually got Jeremy Strong, who plays... The, I'm the oldest son! Fucking that guy um, in the show. And then he gave his own... He Apparently, he was given a poem by the person who was like, this is who this character is. And he reads the poem and he reads it. He talks about the poem being like, when I was doing this arc of the character, this was this part of the poem. This is this part. Like he arced his whole fucking experience off this poem that was given oh, him. Kendall Roy was an amazing. Kendall, Kendall Roy, Roy was... Well, he won. He, he won a... So smart, the actor. But Jeremy he Strong. did it to a T of the guy who's so insecure. Like he just nailed that role, oh, that God, actor. It's like, just, but it's like, you can get everything you want and even when you do, you won't you won't have anything. That's yeah. basically sort of what, alluding to what the poem was out without, uh, you know, a couple of techies in and a few Baileys can't regale really <laughs> <laughs> what it was about. Uh, shout out to shout out to the punter and the dribbler who just who just saw Nathan Cleary sitting there and thought, I'm going to see that motherfucker. Yeah. He's on 192 already with 192. the C on. With the C on. With the I C hate on. you, Matty! With the C on. I mean, he's going big tonight. Oh, Luai. He's going big tonight. Yeah, Let's not pass. rule out 400 with the C. Let's well, not rule no, out 400. Well, we don't 400. want him breaking Tommy Turbo's all-time record. Well, listen, if I'm on him, I'll allow it. And offloading Panthers score. How much oh, is oh, that's gone I missed it. How much are you on? He's on 192 with the C on. With the C on. Okay, so he's fucking... You, you've he's, done a good he's job. He's brainy. I so thought about it for a second. Even if you're still having captain him, you're having a good time. 
forces a yeah, drop everyone's out. That's got points. It. Everyone's got Yeah, it. good point. So, like, yeah, the captain's yeah, yeah. Yeah, point actually, of difference. That's, that's a great yeah, point. P.O.D.P. P.O.D. P-O-D. 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 Who'd you captain, mate? Have you got we a full go, seven? Go, oh, youth of an, is that P.O.D.? No, that is P.O.D. Yeah, yeah. Youth of the nation. Oh, and who's gone on report here? P.S., did you guys see um, some clips of... Uh, oh! Bro, Marty Tapao's just lifted that knee. If that didn't hit a testicle, it missed it by a fucking Bees did. pubic hair. There were some clips of um, By the way. Uh, Lala Lapuza, I think, in Argentina, and Limp, uh, Limp Biscuit were playing, and the crowd. Oh, uh, break shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Break, break, break stuff. stuff. Break Recently, stuff, sorry. Uh, yeah, break like, shit. like yesterday. <laughs> and oh. you're going like... It was it, pumping. It, it was as pumping as it was in fucking 1997. Yeah. Get out. Like, yeah. Pumping. I wish we could just <laughs> split the game for a second and just pop that on and then come back. Know, oh, well, yeah. When the, when the stream's well, off, we'll watch it. When the stream's off, we'll watch it. Yeah. 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 Sorry, the podcast is going for another two hours. Yeah, yeah. Did you see the thing? Was this an old video or is this a new this one? This is yesterday. Oh, fuck. No, I haven't. So like, did you see? That was saying like 23 years later, still pumping. Yeah, oh, I, saw a video, I saw a video of uh, like when MTV used to the spring break and the, and the video was like, I don't know. No, there was that, but there was one where they go like I have no idea what the point of this was but it was Blink-182 performing and then it's Fred just coming down like 10, 9 and he, all he does is he just blows up a boat in the background that's in the bay like there's just this boat and you're like fuck the early 2000s and the 90s yeah look at so this blew up a boat he just like blew up a boat and everyone's like yeah! <laughs> that's so fucking this weird this just sums up uh, I saved this the other day well, is, it, is, it, is it a long thing no like, no no it's, like, it's, it? no it's basically <laughs> we'll make it long if you want to yeah uh. Oh, yeah, Carmen Electric coming out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, and you're fuck like, yeah. Carmen Electric coming out, grinding. <laughs> grinding the lead like, singer. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, so, that's when the world was at its peak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Carmen yeah, Electric yeah. grinding. That's when America was at its yeah, peak. Yeah, yeah. At its Look peak. at that. <laughs> Who is that singing? Lit. Lit. Yeah, but hold on. But so what's, the, what's the song, though? Because if you listen to the song, you'll know it. Listen Who's to, lit? No, that's the thing. You won't be. You'll know the song. There you go. Zoom in. Look at that. That's, Look. See the song so I can... That's good stuff. Uh, just just 90 shit, you know. I actually saw a video. Uh, Millie sent me. Try vid- time. That's too easy. That's oh, too easy. 13 plus. I just need Walshie who's not That's in the game anymore. That's too easy. Let's hump. <laughs> yeah. 13 plus. <laughs> yeah, it's actually 24 plus. Whatever. But I just need Walshie who's not but, playing. Millie sent me a video the other day of just no some people... Sorry. Fucking grooving out in Fat Boy Slim in like 2006, seven, and why our generation, being 33, 32, whatever now is the best, is because we live the hybrid. Because we will have to pull out our phones now, right? If we go anywhere, we'll have to put our phones. But we also lived in the days mm. of where phones didn't no exist. Phones. So when you go see Fat Boy Slim and he's playing right here, right now, when you go listen to fucking Beastie Boys or fucking Chemical Brothers, you're just in there <laughs> in a sea of 100,000 people. No one gives a fuck about their phone, and yeah. then it's gone. Let's just fucking jam up you know try hook up with someone try get where's coming a lecture at you know what I mean like, uh, Turkey you know, you know, Seb Turkey 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 Oh no, but, I watched it through my phone and that's why Carmen doesn't pop out because yeah, you're Carmen fucking doesn't on your phone because you're loser. filming her <laughs> Karma's not going to come out and grind on someone if she knows she's no. getting filmed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is, yeah. Yeah. It's such a good point. It's such a salient point of, like, the upheaval of the moment. Some ceremonial fucking sacred Karma lecture coming out going, I can't help it, but fucking dance. And you're like, yeah, the 90s. Yeah. But when everyone's going, oh, I'm going to put it on my story, it doesn't happen. No, no. It doesn't what? happen. Yeah, get out but of here. But I'm not shitting on people. We, we're uh, in our story. Guys, look, well, yeah, story guys. Yeah, cool. we're, we're big like, social media guys. Yeah. Now. Where's your it. carbon electro? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they don't have it. All no. they have is Sydney swimming and TikTok. That's it. Like, yeah. that's yeah. Harry Styles going, going to call your God. mom. <laughs> Call your mom while I'm on stage. <laughs> look, at this, look at this. Look at this dribbler in the background with the fingers crossed. Love that. That's rugby league. Well, that's, like hoping Nathan hits it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking 26 2, and you're hoping yeah, he no, hits that's, it. It's rugby league. Look it's at them all filming Nathan. Look at this. Look at this random, inconsequential <laughs> Nathan Cleary kick that people feel like they yeah, need to feel. That's film. my point. Yeah, like, that's my point. This kick means nothing. It's 26 2. But I'd like him to hit it. Oh, oh, oh it's a fade. Oh, he's, he's so 
good. good. He's so he's, good. He's, he's so good. He's so good. He's so good. He's so good. And I, so good. I got to go on the record and say I really like Cleary. Like, I love Nathan Cleary. I'll never leave the Panthers. Of course you do. But fuck you. No, no, no. You got to. You got to. You got to give Nathan Cleary. No, but if you're feeling a fucking intercontinental, dude, he's the king. I know we say Gutho's the king. I know everyone believes that. No, that's of fans say that. I will. Cleary is. I'm not going to say. This is the one. Look, I don't know rugby league for shit half the time, but. Cleary, I saw. I used to watch. I, I saw him reserve guys, but Burmo, <laughs> you can back me up. I came to you who used in high school. You were the rugby league guy, and you said, "All you know, same as you are now." But I go, "Bro, watch out for this guy called Greg Inglis." Before he, he even debuted, yeah. is that right? Uh, yeah, I, go, I go, "Watch yeah, out yeah, for this out, motherfucker." Dude. He was like, "You saw some. You saw like one this try <laughs> that he did where no, like I saw like a highlight package of him." I thought you saw. I thought it was like not before he debuted. I thought it was like he was, it was almost like one of his first games ever. Yeah. And you were like, "You've got to see this psycho no, so from the, Melbourne." No, no, because he did this thing where someone like kicked, and it was. The ball was out, and he kicked around the guy and went in. Then, a few weeks later, I went down to Streety's place, and Greg was playing. And you guys could look this up, Dior, but he scored three tries in about eight minutes against Penrith for Melbourne. And that was on my own. This guy's fucking insane. That's, I'm not saying I'm rugby league guru. I'm not. But, the but way, I, I had Greg. The way, I had Greg. So it's also sort of in the style in which you get him to. Like, I bet you it's like two of those tries were they're running up to grab him, and he's upright going, fuck off. Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck! Like on the yeah. try line, running along. He the was line, just like, a freak. Off, like no one's. Off. And you like, and then they drop him. He drops them at the. He's like a. He'd be a great boxer. He'd have a great jab. I just don't think anyone's it. come yeah. even close to to GI. Like uh, Trell's obviously a an amazing. No, but football. Greg was Greg's something like, Greg was a, Greg, a, Greg was something a rough. Else. Greg dude. deserves a model status. They won't give it to him, but he deserves. Yeah, because he's not a playmate, but like fullback. Well, sure, he won mate. a fucking. He won the grand final in a hard five eight. If you if you're handing out a more like a model status, Greg should get it. He should. Well, Greg was anthropomorphized. He was a he was a goanna. Yeah, and Great you don't word. get that unless you're Great one word. of the greats. Also, shout out to Bailey's, which yep. just keeps it, working. Keeps working. It's it's it's. it's oh goodness! Oh, Tom, the poor just, old Broncos. It's yeah, just not fuck. their night. You know what it is, Eddie? It's silk sheets. Yeah, it, it, it and you're is. You're getting silk dirt into the dirty deeds. You know what it's sheets. like? It's like it's like after a long hot. Day, you have a nice cold shower and you slip into some fresh sheets. That's oh, there's bonus. nothing better than that. That's a bonus. Fresh bed sheets, dude. Maybe a pillow chocolate. After a cold shower, maybe a pillow chocolate. <laughs> maybe a pillow chocolate. Maybe some, maybe some uh, hotel. Nice touch. Maybe some hotel uh, slippers. You know, maybe a robe. Oh, here we go. Look at this bottle of lube. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. Go in again. Yeah, they will. Just they will. The Look at wounds, that. You oh, fucking losers. Oh, go. How strong is he? Yeah, too yeah, strong. He's got strong. There. Too he's strong. Done it. Wow, he's got there. Is he over? Did he get there? Yeah, he's over. He got oh, there. Oh, no. This is getting barbaric. What's the score now? 30 to go. Shit, dude. This could be a 50 pointer. Fuck. This could be oh, a dog going to win the granny. Oh, this is 32 barbaric. to 2. We've got 30 minutes on really? the nose right now. Listen, tell you what, vape. nice to get a bet. Nice to get a bet. So how many how many games now for you, Tom? Uh well, whatever. How many games there are this season? I haven't hit one, so whatever that is. But I've been close. It's all right. You're winning them early. You're not winning them late, mate. You know the rules. Yeah, sure. It's good. Careful it's good that. to have a competition where you go. These guys are the standards. Your Manly team is in contention. There's Dude, no Manly it. teams, Eels, Manly Eels, teams good. at least on the last two games, are in contention. So at least it's like a cool season that's kicking off where it's like, oh, we don't know what's going on. It's like, no, nah, there's a few teams cream into the crop and clearly Penrith are putting on a show. They went in let's against them. How, let's see how this meanders out. What are your thoughts on what I've just laid out? Well, there's just a few stats from Matty the Waterboy around Greg, uh, Greg Inglis. Clive Churchill at 5'8 oh. and won the Daly M 5'8 of the year. Golden Boot at centre and probably the best centre ever. Won the comp at fullback and got Daly M fullback of the year. There you go. Tick, tick. That's but Maddie, the thing about Greg, Just a fucking yeah. another just... Well done, mate. That's the thing about Greggy stuff. is that... Okay, so if you take your playmakers, Cooper Cronk, your classics, of just like figuring out the game rugby league in terms of the general, how to manage it. The general. And all that stuff. And then you've got your up front tr- nut truckers, whether it's Webkey or Payne House, slightly different. Sure, but like that's the thing. Greg, in terms of that, just break tackles, 
defend and, and run fast and just fucking also be a playmaker. No one has had the combination of everything a back should be better than Greg. No. Mm-hmm. No one has. But uh, we're naming up, name a more damaging ball runner. There isn't. The guy, you couldn't tackle the bloke. He was a freak. He was a complete freak. An absolute freak. That try he scores when he gets knocked at the end and then and slides and then Goanna's like, oh, no, he doesn't. He just steps up and Mate, like when, um, licks his lips. He's one I'm, of the great tries all time. Was that against the Broncos? I yeah, think it was yeah, the Broncos. Uh, yeah. Anytime I'm overseas and I bring up rugby league, that's the try I show people. Yeah. It's the best like try. The, it's yeah, it's yeah. probably my favourite try. Yeah. Now, just yeah. quickly, fellas, uh, we've got a trivia question here. Reminder to the punter and the dribbler, the hotline, 0483144593 if you want to call, if you want to message. I think the call's actually a wigging because of the amount of people trying to call. So sometimes the calls are fucking out, so shoot a text. Uh, the Gold Coast Titans came into the NRL in 2007, but were not initially going to be called the Titans until a club, for, until a club forced them to change their, uh, their name. Interesting. What were they going to be called until a it's club? Funny. I remember them? voting uh, this on NRL.com the hu- in computer class from uh, Mitch. There, were, I, there was three. I like this. This is great. Yeah. 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 Send in your trivia questions. I'll I remember know. voting yeah, on this. Reverse trivia. There was a vote. I don't know if the vote meant anything, but there was a vote oh, when you went on to NRL.com when you were in high school and you this whole thing was happening. Oh, hold on. Here we go. Here we See go. You later. Give it. Oh, oh give, give it. it. Try. 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 Hat wow, trick. Hat trick. Hat this trick. reeks of a 40. No, no, no forward no, pass. No. Oh, no. It got greedy. No, the same as a forward pass. Is it only, is it counting oh, down shit. from 27? You yeah, dude. Down. Holy shit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that was forward. <laughs> this could be 50. What yeah, you- <laughs> I know, dude. I know, I know. I'm, I still don't get my head around the... Oh, knock uh, on. They lost oh, it anyway. That was no, that's, I think, what it was. Pass. I don't know the Titans' answer, but I know that I that you know how yeah, some, I have no idea you about delete this. shit in your memory to to like save Store certain shit. Yeah, yeah. Where it's like I need to save the cheat code. I don't think so I've ever, yeah, I, I, city. I, yeah, I, I, I need to get rid of the <laughs> yeah. who, who, whoever the Titans were going to be. <laughs> yeah. but I need files. up, down, up, down, X, circle, B, Y, <laughs> uh, L, two, L, two. Is that all weapons? <laughs> 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 yeah, I need the important <laughs> shit. Oh, that's good. Well, I was the answer say the Hurricanes. No, it's the Dolphins, which makes sense. So oh, right. the Dolphins would have put Redcliffe would have been like, "Fuck off, mate." That's so funny, Sebo. <laughs> <laughs> What's Beautiful. that game off? What, what GTA. Did you say? XO, XO. No, oh, you right. do the, uh, yeah, it's like a cheat code. It's a cheat code to get all the way. P.S., yeah, yeah, yeah. in my uh, depths of hell that I've been in, locked at home, not been able to do anything. You know, I've got a Nintendo Switch that I bought for COVID. Oh, I, I do love it. No, I want to get love, one. So I bought it for COVID because Henry, friend of ours, had Mario Golf and I was do that and I play PGA on it. But it was only on Saturday that I figured out you could download the emulator and I've got GoldenEye, I've got Banjo-Kazooie. Oh, I've got, so, shit. But I go, okay, so I downloaded GoldenEye, I go, okay, so when you play GoldenEye, you can play Agent, Secret Agent, Double O Agent, through your missions, and I go, fuck it. Cobo! Oh, God, shades of GI here. Jesus. Go, Cobo! Go, son. Oh, Pin the ears back. No, Targo getting him. Fucking hell, Targo's got some toe as well. See, Greg scores that. Well, yeah, but I guess I oh, thought Cobo was every day of the week. Cobo's obviously quick. Yeah, but, Greg, but quick. Greg scores I that thought, is the point. Yeah, I thought even that, if they catch Greg, Greg scores. Oh, it. Stag- yeah, that's right. Cause he throws them off. Stags has been quiet. Stags is it? Is he even playing? Mm-hmm. Well, you've already beaten him. Yeah. Um, but shout out to me for beating Dam on Double O Agent Goldeneye, the first level, because I, anyone can beat it on Secret Agent or Agent. But I beat Dam on Double O Agent. Oh, well done. That is good. <laughs> very impressive. Yeah, that's impressed. good. Very impressive. For anyone that doesn't know, it's a very hard thing to do. Um, it's not. Oh, wait. Sorry, is that which, no, which the hardest, the hardest setting, one? but it's level one on Gold. Oh, but yeah, still hardest setting is nothing. No, 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 listen, listen, oh, I'm like, listen, very I'm humble of you. Uh, did you, ever, us with what did you, you ever finish <laughs> da, Get in there. Donkey Kong 64? I didn't have it, no. Ooh. Give me Jock Madden. You didn't have Donkey Kong? Or Diddy Kong you Racing? You didn't have Diddy Kong. No, I had Diddy Kong Racing. It's, that's not Donkey Kong. Donkey oh, sorry, Kong's the yellow <laughs> game, man. <laughs> it's a different game. When you've on, got a... On N64? Yeah, when when all the bananas I are I finished Diddy Kong. I had to fucking race that bloody... 
the war plane, pig. The well, plane. no, but you had to go to you had to go to space. You had to go to space. Yeah, you had to beat him a couple of yeah. times. Yeah, and then uh, you do the uh, the oh, levels in reverse. Oh, Meyer over you know, there. You never, you never they had the swordfish, the with the the Super Nintendo, the um, Diddy Kong, Donkey Kong. Sorry. Yeah. No. Uh, Donkey Kong I mean, was no, Super Diddy Nintendo. Kong. I'm pretty sure. And then you were oh, jumping soup. the barrels and the the little. The, the little bananas. All I top. know is that when you lent this guy a game, I lent him GTA 3. It comes back to you. You put it in your fucking place. So it doesn't work. Scratch. Oh. doesn't work. Scratch oh. the shit. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's <laughs> not good. <laughs> I'm not going to bring it up, but, you know. <laughs> well, you brought it up. I brought it up 20 years later. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Man was uh, not happy. <laughs> Oh, sorry, man. <laughs> I've still yeah, got it. I've still got it. At least you got your apology, Sebo. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I tell you what. Worth it. This has been a fucking it. rugby league statement. I know that the Broncos yeah, are down. Been, a, yeah, but it hasn't been that much. Like, if you think about that. 34 Walsh, points? Yeah, but Walsh out, Reynolds out, Payne Haas out. Yeah, like, three of their biggest exactly, players. Exactly, exactly. It's not a, like, it's if you're a Broncos a fan, you're just like, fuck this game. But, like, but they fucking still did it. They've yeah, come out and put thirty four. Of course and they counting. were though. Of course they were. What? Okay, was it that obvious? Why did yeah. not why why did he have him plus eight and a half? I keep when, when Reynolds was out. Because he can only win a fucking putting season if he's helped by fucking no, Holden. No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 that's how it wasn't your own. Like it was so obvious. You wanted no. as well. No, 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 I'm, no I, uh, what are you I'm saying about? I'm saying that it's not like a it's not a bad loss for the Broncos. I'm saying what? this is this Why? has been very impressive from the from the Panthers. How it has it not? been, They're but it also but I'm saying before was, the game, but the you context, had thought that the Broncos would cover eight and a half I points. I didn't know Payne was out in fairness, and not that that would have changed too much. But it, either way, fairness. this is almost going to script. Mm. This is going to script. Well, yeah. if, you know, if you know how to read a script like I do, there's no improv here. No. There's no improv. Oh, no fuck, Dylan just Carmen Electra. Serious shot in the eyes. Strutting her stuff. Carmen Electra is yeah. not... She's, she's yeah. done her halftime. This is a two script. Yeah, this is, a, this is expected. Listen, it was an awful tip from me. Mate, I mean, you got to be able to tell it. you got to be able to acknowledge uh, you, it. Hey, just swallow it. you got to swallow it. Could when she'll you be a the though. load that's been bestowed upon you. No, mate, you got to swallow it, dude. Shit house tip. Yeah. Awful. <laughs> God, <Terrible>. awful. <laughs> is Taylor the only Did face tat in the NRL? Uh, that I'm aware of. Look at this, look at... Oh, head clash, Is it Japanese facey, though, or is it... No, he's like a love heart. Oh, look at this, it. look at the head clash here. Taylor mm. May's just taken souls today with his head, and he's actually going off himself. Yeah, but he's got, like, some Japanese symbols up. Oh, his, yeah, no, but he's yeah. got, like, under his eyes, he's got some face tats. Dane Lowry... HIA, 22.43 How do you go and super coach? I need to check that. Mm. What's my boy on? Nathan Clear, is he still dominating or what? Would be. Little but is he going huge? He's going. He's already at 116. Who? Clearing. Yeah, yeah, well, dude, we're in captain. 232. Fuck, I thought about it for half a second I today. said I'm captaining and Matty goes, I'm doing turbo, go turbo. And fuck you, Matty. Yes. I'll never talk to you again. That's the smartest move of all time, Captain Cleary, against a weakened Broncos outfit. Well, he's going to have his hands on the pill, wasn't he? I mean, it's as simple as that. Obviously, I believe in my boy Turbo to go large on Saturday. But Why does mine say Nathan ha- Cleary only has 73 points? Because you haven't captained him. No, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, mate, yours no, no, must no. be lagging. Because you'd be lagging. You'd be he's lagging. A, he's on 100 and fucking... You'd be lagging out the arse, bro. He's on 116 uncaptained. Okay, well, good. You'd be and lagging. Brendan Picour is on 21. What's Ezra on? I can tell it. Two thirty-two so. with but, a with a with twenty minutes to play. You but just do you like? It. Can I ask you a serious question, Tom? Yep. Do you actually take your team seriously? No, I haven't looked at it since last week. Like I don't. I mean, I, I will at some. Ezra point. Madden, oh, go, Ezra. very impressive. Go, Jock Madden. Fuck me, Dad. That would have been good. I need Jock Madden to go in. Honestly, I need Jock Madden to score. That's all I care have about. You, have you got a game. Jock Madden, Jack Cogger? Yeah, I put. I put yeah, it on. yeah, yeah. I respect that. If Jock Madden scores, dude. Oh my god. Daddy, daddy comes. Can I ask you, Sebo, how how now that you've had a couple of techies? Yeah. Oh, how much a triple that you poured me? Yeah. Yeah, but <laughs> how much? How much? How do you feel? Did you really need it? You know. Um, now that it, now that it's in the bod, it's just like it's one Ezra of those. I'm on fourteen, so just everyone knows. It's like one of those situations where, like, right now you're going okay. Like I, when you guys rocked up, I was like half asleep, and now I'm a little bit awake. But oh, more than that, bro. I was trying to think I'm, as I was walking to my Uber here. It's like. You know, it's like, what's the answer if someone goes, like, what's it like having twins? And the way I would put it, like, if you have one baby, imagine having, like, 
a 20 kilo like thing tied to your back and you walk around like that. Like there's always something on your mind. A weight. Good, a weight. Two babies, you got another 20 kilo, but it's not tied securely to your back. It's like clanking around your legs and stuff. You yeah, know yeah. what I mean? It's like carrying and, chains almost yeah, yeah. as so opposed like, to a solid like, okay, weight. It's, it's like double the weight, but it's like clanking around. Yeah. So when you ask me what's it like letting loose as a techie, it's like going, okay, yeah, it's great, but that weight ain't gone tomorrow. Yeah. And so that clanker. But in the, but in the moment. <laughs> the moment, dude. Sometimes in the mo- you have you gotta to. Li- well, sometimes you got to live in the moment, yeah, mate. Isn't, isn't that to be I'm king of living in the moment. Isn't that to be to be human? Give it to Jock Madden. Find Jock Madden. Oh, oh don't wow. Pass it. Don't pass it if you don't need Let's to. Let's have the biggest comeback in NRL no, history here and just get to within fucking <laughs> ten. Eight. No, well, ten and a half. Yeah, well, the bed's eight. I just want to say on behalf My money's on ten and a half. I'm feeling good. This is like my... The, okay, so when the babies were born, they were in hospital for 40 days and we had a wet the head session that you guys came to, you were even organised... And that was like, that was still in hospital. So it wasn't technically that you had them. I had that night out. That was it. This is my first night out since then. It's amazing. There's my first night out since then. Another one. Set him free. 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 Someone play Now You Are Free. Yeah, Gladiator. Um, Can we play that sort of shit over a live stream or does that get us taken down? And you guys have probably heard me say this before. And I, all I'm trying to do is if... Uh, like, I'm not trying to do anything but change one person's life here. And if there's a possibility... <laughs> okay, punch it on Sebo. If there's a, <laughs> Cut it on Seb. If there's a fucking possibility that... Hans Hold on, wait a, a second. No, let me get it up. It's before while you're saying it. So... All you guys who maybe are under, a bit younger than us, you probably go to festivals, but you missed out on the 2004 to 2009 Sydney festivals. Uh, Park Live, fucking Future, Future Music. Future. We Love Sounds. All that shit. Stereo yeah, Sonic. Stereo All that shit. Fucking epic, Fun right? Boy era. Yeah, all that shit. Just amazing. Amazing, right? Cross. The Cross. Um, and so we don't obviously go to festivals anymore. I don't even know if they exist. No, they in do. The way they get, get cancelled a lot in the way that we went to, In the way that we went to them. Uh, but I will say this. And everyone's going on about, ah, oh, Fred again, blah, 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 and looks all right. You know, if you want to go check something good out and have a great night, we were all there. Go check out Hans Zimmer live because he plays all the fucking tracks you could imagine. So he does every movie, Lion King, Gladiator, which is playing right now, you know, Interstellar, all this shit. But it's almost electronic because he has a whole band there, the lights go out and it goes on. All you need to do is just kind of have a couple of whatever and just go out there and it just becomes the best night of your life. It really does. It really does. And so just all I'm trying to say is if he comes out again, make a note and go, yo, instead of, you know, begging to see Fred again, I'm going to go to Hands and I'm going to see all my favourite movie soundtracks meshed up into one with my best mates and go through every emotion of like, let's cry over Maximus, but let's celebrate over Simba. And in the middle, we're thinking about McConaughey and Interstellar. Like, and that's just like 5% of it. The rest is up to how you feel. <laughs> oh, well done. Yeah. Well done. Well done. That was powerful stuff from a powerful man. Powerful <laughs> stuff from a powerful man. But also words to live by. If you <laughs> listen, if you if you're a young Urko kid right now who doesn't know the way of the world, who is obsessed with tote bags and growlers and my favorite bit coming up there. Oh, no, no, no. And farmers <laughs> markets, then maybe maybe look outside <laughs> your your existence and look no, to hard. Keep Put your going. headphones on, home. Eh? I'm saying keep it going. Keep it going, Eddie, until we get to the Oh no 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 Bible. <laughs> I'm saying leave the growler at home, leave the tote bag at home, leave the farmers markets at home, okay? And start to embrace a man of substance, a man of uh, glory, a man of the now, a man of While all you're time. speaking about the man of the now, punters, dribblers, be your own Maximus. Don't laugh at me for saying this, saying I'm an idiot right now, but you're an idiot if you can't have a moment in your life with your mates going like, I feel as powerful that this song's written about me and my journey. That's what you've got to feel in your life because if you go through your life without feeling that at least a couple of times, you've missed out. You're just a loser. But go through sometimes thinking that Hans has written this shit about you, that you experience that emotion. Because if you don't, 
No one cares. They'll put a, a couple of Arnett's on top of your gravestone <laughs> and say, see you later. <laughs> like... Milk Arrowroot. <laughs> the gallon milk Arrowroot. <laughs> Don't be a milk Arrowroot. <laughs> Don't be a milk yeah. Arrowroot. Yeah. Yeah. Be well, Arnett's no. creams, mate. You yeah. know what I mean? Listen to this. This is powerful stuff. And 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 if you if the, the, oh, now the cross is ready. Yeah, sorry. There you go. Hello, Shale. I was going to say you're going to do the double tap. <laughs> yeah, you do it. You do a double tap. Keep singing. And not yeah. yet. And not yet. Oh, this is, yeah, this is when he's going. I'll see you in. I'll see you in the next life. Next life. Yeah, next. But not yet. Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> you want your mate saying that. Over your fucking gravestone. <laughs> so go live your life like it, dude. Instead of just... Yeah. <laughs> Fredigan! <laughs> <laughs> oh, well done. Take your step. Take your step. Take step. Take step. step. back. Uh, yeah. The kid's back. Plenty of Maximus <laughs> about oh, that. fuck yeah. Plenty of Maximus Swords about that. Swords and sandals. That was good stuff. <laughs> you gotta live your life. Swords right. and sandals, baby. <laughs> Fucking oath. That's, That's all done, I think, Hank, sadly. That's rugby oh. league. And this techie's now soiled by just a melted nightmare. See that, but, any, there, but you don't alcoholic? get that problem. You do not get that problem with Bailey's. It no, goes all day. And it but goes, in fairness and to that goes. techie, we've sat it's sat yeah, there for a significant go, amount of time. It goes, but it's out. Is there any um is there more Baileys next to you? What's that? What sort of Baileys is that? It's another bottle. <laughs> no, I feel like it's slightly different. Oh, no, it might have some uh, caffeine in it. Yeah, get Oh, it. well, let's give it a whirl. Well, we'll give the espresso cream a whirl, mate. I'm fucking... Well, you know, you're you're going to be up later. <laughs> yeah, you know. I'll be you up know, in... I'm not, you're not going to sleep between now and four. Sleep, what are you seven? doing? Yeah, don't remind me. Get the, oh, go! Uh, Oh shit, Katoni! So, I, I, Someone just oh. said if they could bottle Techie Seb, I would trade my firstborn <laughs> for a bottle. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Jock Madden, please? Where's could, Jock Madden? Could run through a wall. Up, could run through a wall after that from the great and powerful Techie Seb. <laughs> People, it's it's powerful stuff. Yeah, it is. We might need Techie Seb T-shirts. <laughs> Techie Seb, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fucking oath. With a photo of Maximus Aurelius. Well, no, it's no, him. You almost, you you almost see it, a, a little plastic box that plays that song as you walk around. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the thing that you find inside birthday cards. <laughs> yeah. <when> you <laughs> <laughs> oh, I tell you what, you can get the audio and funny. have birthday cards. cards it's just it's Techie Seb <laughs> <and> Ram. <laughs> <laughs> rambling. <laughs> When you read the dribbling card that you've read, you get the, the dribbler music. card, the dribbler birthday card, <laughs> a so rambling good. of Sebo. Oh, I'm here for that. They're like made out of the stick that you know. They're like the little fucking cards that make the fucking music. Huh? You know? How <laughs> Do you know how they're You're made? Fitted. How they? Yeah, well, how you can make the audio card? You basically open it and triggers like a little fucking thing. Yeah, that's what we're saying. That's, that's what, what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. You mean what we were talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we got we got bogged down in semantics. Someone semantics. wants the next the next hacker major to be gladiator themed. You gotta, oh, you gotta, you gotta you play. Know, you know what? I, tell you what <laughs> I would, I would love that. I had to get it past these two for it to actually happen. Oh, you know? what are you talking about, mate? <laughs> what do we knock back, mate? No, I'm just saying because you know you might think there not be enough dribblers out there who want to be gladiator. Fucking we love gladiator, oh. dude. Do I think there's enough dribblers out there that want to be gladiators? No, no, name me one other character than Maximus Aurelius and gladiator. That's not the point. What do you uh, mean? The yeah, fucking you know, the like Commodus. Commodus. Oh, no. You can name me. Okay, you got Commodus. There you go. give Fuck you, that. you, dude. I know. I like gladiator, but you don't need to know every <laughs> character in the fucking movie to know the okay, movie. Okay, we'll have a gladiator tonight. I'd love a gladiator themed hacker. But like just hand so, him. <laughs> Chris Hope, who won tonight, said, "I'm going to set that monologue as my alarm." <laughs> Imagine waking up Wake to that up. every day. <laughs> <laughs> we should release that as just a, as a podcast audio yeah, yeah, yeah. file that you can Great set idea. as your alarm. Boys, write that down because we'll forget it. <laughs> Please. Yeah, it's beautiful stuff. Thank you, thank you, gentlemen. Oh, what a beautiful night. It's good to be back, boys. It's really uh, nice yeah, to be is. back. Yeah, it is. 34 Another cheers. Another, Another cheers. cheers. Sebo. Yeah, to this, Sebo. Uh, it's a Sebo. So go on the big lift, silly. mate. Well done. You're a great dad. Great dad. But you're an even better dribbler. Eleven thirty to go. Oh, interesting. You just get a thirty-four bit. twelve. Don't hate the espresso. 
No, I don't mind. I'm a classic it's, man, but I don't hate it. It's, there's, it there's, there's not much wrong with it. There's nothing wrong it's with it. You know what I mean? There's nothing yeah. wrong with it. I feel like this won't have bad damage the next day. No, no. Can I be honest with you? I've had a, I've had a whole bottle of Baileys to myself before. <laughs> Swear to God. You wake up cherry ripe. I just there's a part of it where it's like it would be the easiest thing to drink a whole thing to yourself. Can't, if you if you sit down and you got you got some nice music to listen to, you got a great game of football and you got plenty of ice, you'll polish off a bottle of Bailey's, no problem. That's the danger, right? Hundred percent can see that because now it's what, like a box of shapes but in drink form. But you, when know, I, you can't say I've you become can't like stop. a glass of milk guy, even two. Where I'm up at ten trying to do a feed, I'm like, well I'm not just gonna Fucking have a cab sav right now. Like no, a, you're not. Like, not a ten. Like, but just go a glass of milk. Like, I need something to hit me. I need something to hit me, and the milk gives me that Bailey's is the milk with yeah. what the cab sav can give. Yeah, me. yeah, yeah. Exactly, exactly right. Oh, oh, that's a good shot. Was that Stags? That was Stags. That's a great tackle. Eddie, shout out to oh, you and I for made him knock it on. Bets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Congra- well, hey, congratulations. Sure. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm prepared to go early. Yeah. I'm prepared so, to go so early. Easy. Well done. We yeah. get it. Yeah, we get uh, it. Tom, I was sitting there going, of course you just went to script when he had fucking Broncos eight and a half. I like, didn't say anything about going yeah, to script. Yeah, but you just... You, you just, said... You're, oh, you're very oh, revisionist. Fuck off, <laughs> fuck off. You said it was a fucking amazing win, and I'm saying it's not an amazing win when... I said it was a statement. Right. It's not, it a, not? It's not a statement. The team you beat... The team that you played in the grand final last year, they you fucking missing, humped to death. They are missing their halfback, one of the best... The best prop in the competition right, and right, the right. fucking Well, fullback. if it was that obvious, dickhead, why the fuck did you take Broncos plus say, eight and a half? On. When Reynolds was out, you so, knew... It. Okay, hold on. Is a winner statement? Is a winner statement? Does a, does a statement... Is a statement defined by a victory? It's a great win. Is it... It's a fucking sure. But right. you're saying it's a statement win. You know yeah. what a statement win is? Is if it's humping Reese, it, humping. Is, if Reese is playing, if Reynolds is playing, and if Haas is playing, and it's 34-12, that's a statement win, motherfucker. This is not a statement win. They're missing their three best players. That's all I'm saying. You can that's only, all you can, I'm saying. You can only bet who's in front of you, buddy. That's not the on. point. You're saying oh, it's yeah. a statement, I'm you silly fuck. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> You used to give it cut. You haven't got a fucking bet yet. Well, that, that does no. hurt. I'm not going to lie. Give it to Jock Madden. Give it to Jock Madden. Oh, Sebo, have you shook early? Oh, give it to Jock Madden. Oh, for fuck's sake! That's fell backwards. That's is that a drop ball? Not He's lost. Jeez, that. what He's I'd what I'd do for a Jock Madden so. try? What, what'd you get for that in a multi? Fifty-two. Fifty-two dollars. Yep. Get oh, fuck. fucked. Yeah, I know. Well, wow. I'm I'm rooting for you, buddy. That's a big. That's a big yeah, number. That'd be nice. That's a big. I'd have changed some some moods. Tom, you got any cigarettes? Yes, we do. Yes, Where? we do. Where? Not now, mate. Smoke one here. We don't. You, what, what do you want to set alarms off? In what do you want to set alarms off? It sounds like Beverly Street. One two eight Everly Street all Light over a again. Light cigarette. <laughs> you fucking little fucking <laughs> your little cubby house with cameras. You fucking loser. No, hey, it, come uh, to my house and watch the rugby league. Guys, we have to walk two k's away. Oh, oh my god. god! This is an absolute <laughs> witch hunt. No, you can't smoke. Oh, because well, we had to go have a fucking dart at the train station when we stayed at your guys. There. <laughs> <laughs> no, you I'll, can't have listen, a I'll come, in, I'll come in a bat for Burma here <laughs> because of <laughs> because of the the. Shut up, Eddie! <laughs> Shut up, Eddie! <laughs> Shut up, Eddie! The existence Shut of the up, sprinkler. Eddie. The existence of the sp- sprinklers are over here. No, I get it. But there was there was like a certain rules guy back in high school where yeah. Was listen, Burma the rules guy? Well, yeah. listen, yeah, hey, listen. If, if the like rules that. were don't smoke in the fucking place where there's smoke alarms and there's cameras and we shit to, everywhere. We used to just sock them up, but they were yeah, a bit hard. At uni, sock. you could sock them up. Here, you can't sock them up. Nathan, give an arrest. Nah, I'm shitting it. Burma wasn't a rules but he was a rules guy, but he wasn't. But he he was, was a prefect, wasn't he? Yeah. yeah I he didn't was. even go to his high school. He was a, he's a little <laughs> bitch like that in primary school, I'll tell you what. <laughs> Why are this you is, shooting, Mike? This is not fair. This is not fair. Hey, Tom, Listen, mate. I love you, mate. I love you. You were part of my bridal party. Yeah. Both of you were. Tell us I about the buddy you. system and schools. I love you schools. all equally. <laughs> but you were a prefect. Tom, hey, hey, me above some rubbish, guys. <laughs> Fuck it, oh, Leave me alone. That. Pick up that. Pick up that lolly wrapper. <laughs> <laughs> fucking loser. Pick yeah. up that roll up. This is just... Character assassination. <laughs> oh, it is. It is, and it's fun. It's well, it's enjoyable. This is this is the problem, though. When you when you introduce Techie Bailey's bunch of shit, like yeah. you're not gonna not hurl. Dude, people are saying, ab- let the kid have a dart. Let him smoke. Let him smoke. <laughs> let him smoke. <laughs> let him smoke. <laughs> let him smoke. But right, like, 
Oh, yeah, you yeah. can you can smoke just there in the foyer. Yeah, yeah, just just out of the studios. Because if those fucking sprinklers went off, it would be one of the great yeah. shit. Good shows luck trying to get into that, your insurance covering that. It's like, what happened? How'd you set them off? Well, straight had a dart, <laughs> and it's on camera. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, with but seven minutes to go in the game, you he know what couldn't I say? wait. You know what I say? That's your problem. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. It is my fucking that. problem. Another shout out, if I may, to the Bailey's. Can I have a bit more press? Yeah, yeah give oh, him some more press. No, you need some more ice. Have you got more ice? Yeah, anyone? Yeah, yeah. Uh, where are you? Could you get I'll get, some I'll ice, get him some I'll get him some ice. Some ice. <laughs> is that some guy? <laughs> Nilso said if we set the fire alarm off with darts, he'll rock up in a fire truck. <laughs> Sup, Nilso. Really nice guy when I met him. Uh, Nilso's Absolute a good man. Lovely, nice Nilso's guy. a great man. Hey? He just fucked up the um, Newcastle like a major. He, I mean, even though the guys who won that part off were technically from there. But Nilsa, you're the guy that's releasing podcasts about Kurt Mann and all that stuff. We needed you to perform in the Hacker Major and Newey. Yeah, he and you didn't, didn't. didn't perform. Well, he did. He did once the game was done. I enjoyed my time with him. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, no, he performed in that personally. way. Yeah, personally, in that way. on a personal level, which is which yeah, counts top up for, there, huh? He, he, he that, just missed Seba, an easy part. Seba, he missed an easy part. You, you are. You, this is your beast, right? And these guys help you with it. Um, you know, I've I've I've. I've, I've helped you in the early days, but you are the, the Shane McMahon of the Yips. The best dark arts that happen at those things are, yes, the game, the competition, the but Shane the McMahon. dark arts that happen after those things, especially at a place like Newcastle, where Nielsen or whoever the fuck come to life, that's where you buy tickets to the fucking rock show. That's yeah, what that's you're buying ro- tickets that's for. What, yeah, it's a matinee. Am it's I the wrong? Golf. The, go- Am the I golf's wrong? a matinee. It's a matinee. But in, no, no, no. <laughs> the way I put it, anyone who is at least our age, in 2007, Daft Punk came to Australia. They did a show in Australia at Homebush where it was only Daft... It was one stage, Daft Punk. Before Daft Punk was Sebastian and Grossi. Before that was The Presets. Before that was Vanshee. Before that was Muscles. We're talking all Aussie acts leading up to it. That's a hack major right there. It's all contained. But the, the ticket you're buying, the Dark mun- Punk, happens the after the punts have been scored. Yeah, but the yeah. punts are still your Van Cheese, they're still your muscles, they're still your presets. Oh, glory, glory. You know, Shout out to muscles and ice cream. Oh, Dude, yeah. I reckon ice I use cream. muscles once a month in any yeah. content I do. Ice cream <laughs> is going to save the, the day. day. <laughs> Again. <laughs> oh, that's a great Get song. Peace, I might even drugs, like that ecstasy. Up. Or is that peace, drugs, ecstasy? Unity, you respect, and he's like, "This is just classic 2007." 2007 really <laughs> did slap. 2007 was a fucking slap. Well, 2007. That's that's where um, Saltburn based their whole year of excellence off of reverting back to. We get we can't shoot this film with people on iPhones. We have to revert back to a cooler time. 2007. 2007. You're in uh, uh, Club uh, 99 or whatever it was. 77. 77. You come uh, a, you're jumping the yes, w- you, You're jumping the wall to see Kings of Leon at the Horton Pavilion. Uh, Snoop Dogg was a surprise act at Good Vibrations. Uh, all of a sudden, there's all these Aussie acts. We're talking presets. We're talking Van Chi, We're talking Midnight Juggernauts playing at your local areas. These guys that are international DJs are now playing in burnt-out terraces in the cross. I'm not talking the main drag. I'm talking up Kellett Street, <laughs> where all the fucking old-school places were. Oh, and don't you go out there, oh, idiots. Oh, all the girls from the my, my studio. <laughs> All the girls from the beaches had this big blow wave hair, and you're like, "Who's this?" I'll add you on MySpace. Like, let's go hang out. Hey, I, I'll top friend you. Let's go go to Oxford Art Factory and listen to the teenagers. You know what I mean? Like, that's 2007. <laughs> <laughs> yes, dog. Yes, yes dog. <laughs> he's had a couple of soundtrack <laughs> clips tonight. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's been Fucking good. Hell. Clip the man up. <laughs> Clip the man up. That's as simple as that. Beautiful stuff from the man. Three minutes, 20 to go. What a great night oh. on the tools. What a great night on the tools. Good stuff. That's how you get a fucking... That's how you get a win, Tom. Go. Good run. Just I just need Jock Madden, dude. That's all I hope for. And look, it's, it's, it's a fucking tall order. Jock late? Jock late, it'd be good. Three minutes to go, Jock. Jock late. Yep. The bet's done. Jock late. I'll, I'll back in a jock Come late. on, let's all cheer for a jock Madden anytime. That'd be a famous fucking moment. 50% mother. of us have got a bet over three bucks, I think, tonight. So that's pretty good. Well, that's pretty good, right? That's yeah. pretty good for all of us, right? It speaks. Yeah. Oh, oh, jock. Knock on. I just needed Walsh, but he went off. Jock's, he jock's went off like. He went time. off. 
He went off maybe for like a 76 minutes ago. But here you go. All the, the fourth people minute. who might be giving shit going. He went off in the right. fourth minute. <laughs> 76 <laughs> minutes ago. He's brought him up like three times since he went <laughs> off. <laughs> he's like, I just need a Walsh. It's like, but he's out of the yeah, game yeah. though, no, right? He hasn't played yeah. since I, the I, fourth I, minute. I, yeah. I said that knowingly <laughs> no, that he's okay. out of the game. Oh, okay. Reese Walsh is on one super coach points. One. Huh? Race. Is there a chance for all the people out there going, talk about the game, not about fucking how good 2007 was. Okay, I'll talk about the game. Is there a chance that the Broncos suffer what everyone has suffered who versed Penrith in the grand final before? Oh! That's become irrelevant. Oh, They've become irrelevant. Yeah, second Bunny. year, like the next yeah, year, Bunny, just nothing. Eels, nothing. You know what I mean? Like, mm. Storm, nothing, right? Like, is there a chance that we're all high on last year's Broncos? But is there a chance... Did they become nothing? This there, is for the chance. for the guys out there who somehow are still here going, talk about the leg. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, no, 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 mate. I can guarantee you one thing, Seb, that no one He's listening to this stream tonight is wants asking. to talk about the fucking football. I actually mate. haven't seen a comment going, talk about no the game. No one wants to give a no. dog is a fuck. No. Out of war, you've got to presume that these people are out yeah, there. No, they are. But I'll, I'll say this. With 1 minute 24, 1 minute 23 to go, I don't want to put you under the pump. I don't want to put you under pressure, but I reckon a closing monologue might be nice. <laughs> Give me a theme to at least yeah. bounce off. Different oh, song. Shit, yeah, he does need some music. I know, but do, you I need, need the, do you need I the need theme re- to The Rock? I need a reference point. You know what I mean? Oh, look uh, at his look eyes. That. Oh, oh, messed up. Bro, Please. he's fucked. Yeah, that's... Do you like his wrestling some you want to no, go No, 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 just, no, just, I just mean a the reference rock. point. I just need something. You can't go give a closing monologue. It's like, what, what am I closing here? Well, you're closing What am I closing? I tell you what, you're closing. You're Giving closing, the people you, what they want. You, this is also a, I, the Hans Zimmer did the Rock. Yes, Zimmer? he did the Rock. <laughs> what the? What fuck? are you talking about, dude? Have you seen the Rock, Eddie? Have I Han, seen the Rock uh, with Sean Connery and uh, Nicholas Cage? Okay, no. put Each put, one of no, the, put on the Rock main theme. I am, I can give dude. Closing. Don't worry about that. No, no, oh, I need the I need like I need them taking the missiles. Jack, song. Jack, you know Jack, what I mean? Jack. As they're taking the missiles, assault on Alcatraz. It's not called that, but it's pretty much called that. This isn't it. Ooh. No, give me, give me what he needs. Nah. Go, go. Stealing missiles rock. I reckon that will give it to me. This is it. Nah, I want stealing missiles rock. Nah, I want... Stealing missiles with the rock. Yeah, Hans Zimmer. That's what that's I want. That's the song. No, that's just that. That's what just, have I done? That's what have I done? Which is a great scene, but I don't want stealing missiles. You if want? You, you don't want Ed Harris? What have I done? I fucking. Like, but Ed Harris is the one stealing missiles. If you'd fucking seen the movie. Yeah, but that's the fucking. That's okay, the Hummel gets the rockets. Is this it? <laughs> 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 is that what it's called? <laughs> Mad. But is it the music or is it the scene? Yeah, get it on Spotify. Yeah, you just need to skip it for like Let's 30 go. seconds. All right. Because if it's full time now, this works. What are the people that know, more? Seba? Is this it? I think you're thinking of Hans Zimmer, The Rock, Hummel gets the rockets. Rockets. This here. Hold on. What have I done? No, 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 no. There's a set. I've, I've used it multiple. <laughs> Oh, well, let's not be a fucking drama queen about it. No, well, listen, if he, listen, listen, the man knows what he Give wants. Give the man what he wants. The man needs to, he needs to... <laughs> is this not it? I need it. Maybe this is... Just play the scene for me. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Unlock your phone. You're going to have acting dialogue over the top? Yeah. Uh, there's not much acting. Okay. I'll do it. Okay. You've tuned into this stream. It's only round three. Uh, normally in the off season, I'm playing golf. But here tonight, and all of us, hello sports, it's playing at 2x speed or something. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is an absolute fucking kill the stream. Kill the stream. Kill, 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 kill it. Kill it. Kill the fucking stream. Uh, We're, it's done. Too We're done. It's We're done. We're done. Get us 